We're live. <coughs> and yeah, I don't trust my internet for shit. Actually, that's a good point. <laughs> I'll read the questions to you guys. Don't worry. <clears throat> We're live. All right, that's it. We're up. You you gotta turn the volume off though. Yeah, there it goes. Okay. Uh, one second. Oh yes, yes, just popped up on my phone saying you're live. You have no James got notifications. James got full yeah. ad have had notifications. Yeah, yeah, yeah. literally. Look. Look. I don't know. Oh, I've blocked the camera so shit. But yeah. I got full ad on mute. You know when you can mute someone? That's what you I don't have one. no, you don't. <laughs> you don't. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what are we doing? Let's go. We're we're fucking yeah, live. Yeah. This is it, three of us. We're in three. We're, um, Merry, we're... Merry Christmas to everybody watching. Wait, is that your Christmas cup as well? This? No, this, my, yeah. is, uh, this is a good morning handsome oh, from my the, wife. The font, the font looked very Christmassy. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I, was close, I was thinking, yes. No, I'm not that festive. Oh, um, it should be this year. James, what's going on, man? We haven't talked to you in forever. How are you? I was just about to say, I feel like James has been off radar. Sorry, carry on. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. We're... Good, so just because... Just been fucking moving around so much you're in the uk so, now for how long oh yeah not sure not sure not sure nah I'm are just you kind of enjoying you? myself i was just gonna ask how is the feeling uh being back in the uk versus being in florida i know, I know you're having a lot of fun in florida but I, it's, you don't realize how much you miss your home hmm. until you're back in your home so like right now i think it's the time of year as well obviously it's a very like homey time of year you know like we like to sit inside and stay warm and i suppose a christmas without that would have been a bit odd so i'm kind of glad i'm here because i think if i had a christmas in florida it would have gone by and i wouldn't have really noticed this christmas because of the weather and stuff whereas here it i can feel, feel it it doesn't yeah. feel like christmas if it's hot it has to be no, cold like, and this is nice ben like cold winter nights get in and you're like oh, i really appreciate you having a house you know? it's gotta be then, dark it's gotta yeah. be dark early you know yeah i love it I, i'm enjoying it actually yeah because in norway at the minute and i'm just at home alone with a cat so i'm just chilling Mate, I saw her, I saw her story. She's fucking like skiing, skiing. She's skiing or some yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She went skiing today. So, so Yannicka's home in Norway with her family for Christmas. Yeah, I was invited. Don't get me wrong, I was invited, but I just done so much traveling and stuff this year. Yeah, I just wanted to have a real quiet one and just relax. I was just so you're chilling. What? So you're chilling by yourself for Christmas. Yeah, yeah, I'm chilling just by myself and, for Christmas. You and friends and stuff like that. Me, Monty, and then uh, my friend, one of my Monty. good friends, Daniel. Yeah, one of my good friends, Daniel, just invited me over to his. So I'll probably go around his because we've been with childhood friends from like way back. So he's always like welcoming when I. Is that the guy that's got a cinema room in his house? No, that's Arjuna. I was there last night watching The Matrix 2, the second one. Oh, the second one? You didn't watch Yeah, just I've seen the first one a few weeks back before, actually, not a few weeks back, before I went to the US. And then we've done number two and we'll do number three next week. Wait, we'll you've not seen them before? Or you yeah, of course I have. Yeah, yeah, no, no. Oh, okay. Re- all right, all right. Redo them. No, I, bet Ford has, I bet Ford hasn't seen them all. You would bet wrong. Oh. I've seen I love The Matrix. I'm I don't. Surprised. Um, if, you, if you quiz me on them, I will fail the quiz miserably because you know, I don't, you know I don't my have, dogs, have a horrible memory. You know, my dogs are named after <coughs> Matrix, Matrix characters. Really? Yo, you Doza, know, yeah. Do- Doza, Z, and Cass. Uh, I gotta, I gotta just give a shout out to uh, Balkan Knife. Hey, from Croatia, thanks for the live feed. Thanks for the money, big dog. I appreciate it. Um, okay, James, James, keep a note of how, how much. Money, <laughs> James, keep, keep tabs. <laughs> Need to see the super chat. Is it a super chat you got right now? Is that what I it guess. Is? Yeah, just people. Yeah, just it highlights. Talk. It highlights the uh, the good yeah. comments. With the good people. I wanted to show this real quick though, uh, James. You look oh, like you know what? You you're looking good, man. I want to just show this real quick. Oh, yeah, I, don't, I don't look like I did fucking a few weeks ago. Fucking piece of shit. What do you mean? I'm sorry to look like me again. Thank fuck. Yeah, you look like a big fucker now all of a sudden. Uh, like well, I'm fucking... Look how full you look. <laughs> oh, my God. It looks like you got all your muscle back. I fucking hope I have. I'm, I'm going for more as well, trust me. <laughs> yeah, that's a, really well, you, good, that's a really good look, man. Yeah, I'm fucking... What are you, 290? Like, just under, I think. Okay, I don't want to get a whole bunch of people talking shit, but just out of curiosity, what do you think? How many? How much higher do you think you would have placed if you would have came in like this at the Olympia? Well, that's not in shape, shape. If I had that, no, no, no. Fullness, I don't mean, I don't mean yeah. shape. I mean like this oh, muscle. Yeah. Fucking sixth or seventh. Yeah, yeah. I would have liked to see you this this full. 
Like, and, and that's not, I, again, like people put it like, you just, you know, shit, but fucking, uh, listen, December, just December next year, we'll see. You're, are you, hey. what What are you, sorry, uh, sorry, Ben, what are you, are you planning, what are you planning to do next, Ben, or James? Ben, Ben, what are you doing next? No, um, well, I know what Ben's I, I, Honestly, I don't know. I'm just like, right now I'm just eating and training and I'm just letting my body do what it's doing and I'm, yeah, I'm just kind of in my own head at the minute, if I'm honest. Yeah. So you don't have any any show lined up for the spring or no? I want to put some muscle on and I want to hold it for a while and literally come back and shut some fuckers up. Do you think it's better? Do you guys? I ask each of you. Do you think it's better to? Do you think it's better to do a spring show, take a break, and do the Olympia, or do you think it's better to get in shape, do a show, and then do the Olympia as soon as you can right after? If you've already got the muscle you need, then that's fine. If you need Wh- more muscle, which one? Can... Which one? If you have the muscle, yeah, you have what? Yeah, the second you can one. do a, an early show. And then oh, you can have okay. a break because you don't, yeah. you're not needing to spend a, a sufficient amount of time in that surplus to then gain new tissue. So, like Nick, for example, Nick, if he really wanted to, could do something off the bat, something mid year, something end year, because he's, he's already got all the muscle. Well, wait a minute. Speaking of that, I know I he's think... not doing anything like that, but he has. Oh, all the oh here we go. Here we go. Yeah, you're going to bring I... up that m- monstrous picture now. Uh, I just, one second. When, when is the RBP BC tour you all have? Change the world of bodybuilding. You're the true pioneers of the new era of social bodybuilding. P.S. Female sperm is now a term at my gym. Thanks to you all. <laughs> um, thank you very much, Josiah. But no. So Nick, I would say everybody who knows Nick or has seen Nick on stage would say Nick has enough muscle. Until I saw the picture he posted today. Looks like more. And I'm like, no, he doesn't. And it's like, you know what the funny thing is? Nick said on my podcast the very first time I had him on RBP, we did a one on one. Nick said to me, I'm going to win the Olympia in two years. And somebody, some pros and some people scoffed and they're like, oh, whatever, this and that. I swear to God, he's made a believer out of me. When I saw this fucking picture today, I was like, what the fuck am I looking at? This is weird. Mm. This is really weird. No, this. Look at this. Yeah. Like this is. It's it's like the um, Evan sent a party picture that he took, but even more me. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah, it's it's crazy. Yeah, Nick looks great. Look at the leg. Look at look at the guy. Is that he even looks, a leg? He looks like a fucking freak. Like I don't know. Well, he is a freak. He looks no, like freak. but no, no. Now he's oh, yeah, but he was freak two point oh. He was already a wait, mutant, wait, wait. but now he's wait, actually a fucking mutant. Oh look! Why is he? <laughs> we, while we're while we're praising, <laughs> while we're praising you, it's it me. <laughs> yeah. Fucking How Nick, what is this, dude? Called a freaking nature. What are you yeah, doing? Right. You put on like a hundred pounds. Of yeah, wait, wait, wait. Right. Let me get, let me get a pen and paper. Nick, what are you doing? Yeah, yeah tell us what you're doing. Why don't Write you list your, list your meals for everybody so we can all copy? <laughs> What's your macro? I eat, a, I eat a lot of eggs. How many eggs? Like six. That's a lot. For me. You okay. eat the shell as well. You just eat everything. You just like whole fucking. The shell, the shell, the whole thing. I don't even <laughs> cook it. I just. <laughs> you're fucking. Yeah. Okay, seriously, what's your breakfast? Tell me your breakfast. Um, right now it's uh, three hundred and twenty grams of rice, uh, two hundred grams of beef, two whole eggs, and two pieces of Dave Killer's bread. And that's all cooked, all cooked, right? Oh, and hundred grams of blueberry. Okay, that's actually not three yeah, hundred. You train right after that meal, right? So that's going to be your bigger. Yeah. Okay, what's your post workout meal? Four hundred grams of rice. Um, 200 grams of beef and that's it okay everybody who's listening write this down so you can copy Nick's diet and, do, and <laughs> yeah, get as big, get as, big as him so, no I, I, I watched his uh, day in the life YouTube video right I did, yeah. I did as well so Nick's not doing like post workout shakes and no I don't have any shakes I just eat six meals yeah just fucking pounds food what's the third meal chicken and rice right now. it was a chicken and rice one I remember from correct we know it. We know it better, Nick. It's chicken and rice. And then everybody everybody say right now. with the, with these pepper and onion mix on it. That's oh, right. it's my um, it's my rice, uh, chicken, banana, and almond butter. Rice, chicken, banana, and almond butter. Four hundred grams of rice, probably. No, that one's like I think three twenty. Three twenty. It's weird doing it in cooked weight with rice for me because I'm used to uncooked. 
But it's about so, three times the amount in it. So every when you cook rice, it goes to about three times. So the yeah, amount. it's like 130 grams raw. Yeah, yeah. It's because I cook mine in a rice cooker, so I like put, I might put 600 grams in a rice cooker, and then that's four servings of 150. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? What do you eat for your last meal, Nick, before bed? You just have protein and fat, or is it like? It's carbs too. We do okay. five pieces of uh, Dave Killer's bread. What's Dave uh, Killer's bread? It's it's like, like, we're giving yeah. somebody a plug here. We're going to give somebody a plug here. I want to know what Dave Killer's bread is. It's like um, it has like no flour in it or some shit. Oh, so it's like it's like, uh, it's like Ezekiel. Ezekiel. It's a bit like Ezekiel. It's like Ezekiel bread. Yeah. Is it better than Ezekiel bread? Like tasting? I like both. I mean, it's, it? just, it's a preference. Like yeah, Ezekiel think... bread's frozen. This isn't frozen. This is fresh. Yeah. Does yeah. he send? Does he send it to you, or do you get it at the grocery store? You get it at the grocery store. Oh, Who okay. sent it to you now? So they send it to you. Fred, Dave, go back to his, pic- go back to his picture. One on second. Instagram. Dave Killer's bread. Send me some bread because I knew you were going to fucking ask for I knew you were going to fucking ask for it. Have- <laughs> they don't have it at my grocery store. <laughs> I want to try it. I, I, hate, I hate that Ezekiel bread has always frozen. Okay. You just asked if Nick's last meal a day is just protein and fat, carb free. Fuck off. Besides the <laughs> motherfucker. Well, I don't know. Nothing what the fuck he's doing is carb free. Okay. Nothing he does is normal. So I need to know. What the fuck he's is he's not doing? He's not doing protein and fats before bed. I'm telling you that. You know, I'm just checking, just making sure. I'm two. Uh, I'm two eighty six here. You're two eighty six in that photo. Yeah. Hey, how does this work? I weigh two ninety, two ninety one this morning. I don't look like that. Yeah, but Nick's you're five like, foot. You're three. like six. You're, you're tall. <laughs> yeah, Nick's short. It's bullshit. I'm a short stub. You know. I gotta be like I got to look like Nick. I gotta be like three hundred and eighty pounds. Is your <laughs> hey? Is your ju- is your junk short and stubby? It's all guff. It's all guff, right? Your junk. Yeah. Short like a like a can of corn. Short and fat. <laughs> short and fat. <laughs> You're not gonna get no depth, but you stretch that shit out. <laughs> stretch it out. It even it even it evens it out. It's not long, but it's fat, so it gets the job done. Uh, Merry Christmas to everybody. Nick's here. Merry Say Merry Christmas. Christmas. Uh, listen, so, I got to so, so make, hey, gotta make this plug one. real quick. I got to make this plug real quick. Uh, just for podcast people, use code Xmas21 at the hostile site and get 21% off uh, all the way to tomorrow night at midnight, Eastern time. Okay. Sorry. We're going to close. I was saying this is Nick's uh, debut on here. With bodybuilding bollocks? Yeah, 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 it's, it's just, yeah, I've never yeah, done yeah. a podcast with these guys. Well, mm-hmm. that's because this isn't a bodybuilding bollocks. This is a what are you blowing my mind? It's an, RB, <laughs> it's an RBP Christmas. <laughs> what the fuck oh. is going on? You, wait, you, you're doing this in stages. You're fucking <laughs> with my head now. I thought it was a three of us, now there's five of us. Ben, by the time we're done, you're not gonna be able to get a word in. Oh, no, please just leave guy to the very end so we can all actually say something. <laughs> I agree with that one. Brett, what's going on, man? How are you? Hey, what's up? What's going on, guys? Merry Christmas. Big Brett. Christmas. Good to what see you, James. You too. Happy birthday for the other day, by the way. Oh, appreciate it. Happy that. birthday. Happy birthday. How old are you now? Happy birthday. 35? 33. 33. Oh, fuck, you're getting there, man. It's your prime right now. You got to make it happen. You got to take advantage. You got to take advantage now. You're almost at the, like, once you get to 40, it's all over. I knew yes. I was 23 because I did literally nothing yesterday. Nothing was different. I just, I trained and sat around and there's no no celebrations <laughs> no there's no parties at 33 no it's like no uh this guy says big dick brett is in the building is it <laughs> is, that, is that your nickname <laughs> that guy i guess <laughs> wait, that guy, wait. That guy thinks so. to <laughs> i was gonna say is that ivana, ivana is in the chat is she yeah <laughs> what'd you get ivana for christmas can you say is she there or no well oh this will be aired after it's going to be aired probably. Wait, wait, well, wait, wait. Live. We it's all, live. Yeah, it's listen, live. Yeah, we're, we're, uh, I, can, I can't right. say. It's a big surprise. I got a huge surprise coming. Really? How much did you spend? Can you say that? Way too much. Over 500? That's the right answer. answer. That's over the right five, answer. Definitely over, five, over a grand. O- over a grand. Yeah. Over 1,500. What? Yeah. It was, it was 1,600. Oh. Holy hey, shit. Troy, you're paying him too much. I think so, right? I was just going to say that. <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm just saying the this is for the next like four Christmases. <laughs> James, what did you get? Uh, can you say what you got? Uh, yeah, wait, 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 wait. What? what? One rule for one man applies to the others. You can't tell the secrets. There's no way well, I, can I can do. Tell. I can do mine. 
Because what'd you do? She what'd knows. You do? She knows everything she got. What did you get her? Uh new MacBook, and then a you know one of those outdoor lamp heater things. Yeah. 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 We got one of those, and then we're gonna put seating. She needs to find the seats that she wants, so we can. I want to sit outside and have cigars in the evening under the. Oh, under the that's a good idea. Yeah. Your so wife. Getting, have, I think you're getting paid enough as well. <laughs> can your wife sit outside in in the cold? I mean, if that's you have the heater, she, that's, she won't know at the minute. But if I get the heaters, then yeah. Does Denise smoke cigars? No, but she'll sit with me when I smoke them. See, my wife won't do that shit. She'll be like, "It's too cold out here. I'm going in." And be no, she'll of, sit there. And that's why you got the heat dogs. And, yeah. yeah, I don't know if she would sit out there with the heater. That's a good idea. I'm going to ask her. Ask, get one no, don't ask, well. no, don't ask her. Just get the heaters and then be like, and the yeah, But then if she thinks it's yeah. shit, then I'm sitting out there by myself with a heater I don't need. Well, FaceTime ah, me and we'll, we'll smoke cigars. Oh, that's FaceTime. Why, <laughs> yes. That's, FaceTime. Why you have a, that's why you have a dog because they're so loyal to stay out there with you. They'll sit out there with hey. me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. For what? Yeah, sir. A reason I can't, again, I can't fucking chill what I've got is because it's the same situation as Ben. She's literally WhatsApp to me everything that she wanted me to get for her. So <laughs> she sent me links to Amazon to what to buy. So I've just pressed the button <laughs> and pressed buy and then it comes and that's it. So everything that's on the table downstairs, she's about, she's actually told me to buy. So, so you guys didn't, okay. How many people here actually like surprise tried, to, tried to surprise their wife, to surprise their girlfriend or wife? We're too old for that. I shit. do but on Christmas. Wait, this guy uh, asks, uh, well, first of all, you want, one guy asked, what's up with Paul? Paul's on vacation in Mexico right now. That's why he's not here. Oh, and Paul. and uh, the other guy asked, does James use a squatty potty? Use code MUTANT20 when you want to buy squatty a squatty potty. potty. Yeah. <laughs> you know what a squatty Wait, potty is, James? I haven't seen this one. What's oh, going fuck. on? Are you serious? No, no, hey, you, you, know, you know what? I, I saw this and then I figured out, because I'm tall, I just have to use my tiptoes and then I'm up. That's true. Yeah, Ben's tall enough. And my knees. Tell, my tell knees me about this anyway. point. Okay, one second. I'm going to show, show you. I'm going to show you. Show me this shit and I'll tell you if I do. Okay, this is a squad <laughs> Oh, I did see this. Yeah, fuck yeah. This. So I this resemble thing, that. But just this thing that he's got his feet on, that thing's called a squatty <laughs> potty. So it elevates yeah, your knees amazing. so that you can get a better angle here. All right. Well, I and, don't use the squatty potty, but I do hold my knees when the shit's struggling. <laughs> <laughs> so it's the, same, it's the same principle, but I just wrap my. I do literally what Nick's doing there, but I just pull it up myself. So you just hold your knees up instead yeah. of the rest. No, man, you got to get a, a squatty potty. I Damn. should probably get a squatty potty because it'll save my my psoas. I, I got so one. I got one. Ian's got one. We, we, we you like actually it. got yeah, one. Yeah, you actually, yeah. you actually got one. I got a wooden one. It's like classy. It's oh, like, I think I saw okay. that. I think, yeah, you I got saw a classy one. <laughs> it's like oak. <laughs> hey, you know what I figured out? You know we were having this big debate about how you wipe, right? Standing or sitting. I could never do the sitting thing, but I figured out what I was doing wrong. What, oh, I was, you were doing something wrong? Okay. <laughs> yeah. So uh, this might help some people out. I had my drawers up too high. They're like just below my knee and you, yeah, can't, get yeah, open, yeah. you can't get them open. You have to put them around your ankles and yeah. then you can get your knees. Then you of can course. get your legs wide enough. So, so all the while move. you were just putting your tri- like pants down to your kneecaps. Your kneecaps. Just past my kneecaps, which I normally do. No wonder you were you fucked. To keep your shin warm. Why would you yeah. do that? Because you only put it down as far as you need to. to yeah, but your thighs are still basically pressed together. No, man. I pull the shit all the way to my... Why are we always talking about shitting on this podcast? The man thing, yeah. <laughs> It always revolves back to this, right? <laughs> <laughs> hey, oh, I was you, to, brought up, you brought it up. I was trying to give Nick a, a plug because I also somebody asked if James uses Squatty Potty. Can so, I ask funny. a question to you all? Is that right? Sure. Like, you know when you're like in trouble when like you've literally has no toilet roll? What would you rather um, sacrifice? The, the underwear you're wearing or a sock? Wait a minute. Are you are you home? Wait, what? No, no, no. You're out and about. Like, let's say you're yeah. out and you're, you're nowhere near home. The underwear. So I'm in, so I'm in public and I have yeah, to go to the bathroom. Yeah, you're in public and you need to, you shit and then you notice there's no toilet roll. What do you sacrifice to use to wipe your ass with? Is it a sock or are you going to your, use your underwear and then throw them away? Underwear. underwear. Nick, you don't wear underwear. It won't work for you. I know, but I would pick underwear. <laughs> no, but you're not wearing underwear. <laughs> Imagine well, if this Nick walks around with a spare pair of underwear just to wipe in case. <laughs> Nick, you don't wear underwear. What? You'd have to use a sock. No, I can't use a sock. Or would you just stand up and go home? You'd be like, fuck, I guess I got to go home now. I would probably go home. Just clench. I would go home too, I think. Yeah, I would probably... Got- I would probably use a sock and then go home. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, you need to wipe it somehow. Yeah. Somewhere. Yeah. I, I'm losing the underwear. I'm sacrificing the underwear. 
Brett? Yeah, I, I, I would sacrifice underwear. I don't but if it's at a, like a relative's stuff. wedding and you can't go home, you're stuck. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. <laughs> you got to use your dress sock. <laughs> yeah. Like... <laughs> the thing is, you could use your headphones. Is that that's dress sock well. enough, though? The that's dress sock. That's what I mean. You're using I underwear. might need both socks. Can we not All talk right. about shit? Can we, can we please not, not talk about shit? For like just, can we just finish this podcast? I know. Okay. For how for how long? We'll for how long? We're like at, at least minutes, 20, at least twenty at least twenty minutes. Right. We'll leave it there. I just did. I actually that was a serious question on my behalf. No, it's a good question. I think it's a good question. Um, <laughs> Brett, how's your prep going? It's going good. It's going good. And, You're what you know, in the sec in the second weekend? Yeah, second week. Um, a little different this week, being back for the holidays and stuff. So you know, kind of. Making do with you know Jimmy equipment and stuff, but still, still just getting it done. Where where is back home? Where are you right now? I'm in Des Moines, Iowa, right now. So the gyms there aren't like they don't have enough. No, stuff they're not. There. They're not really bodybuilding oriented gym, so it's slacking on some equipment. Um, and like training intensity, you know, a little bit like you know, still train very hard, but when you're surrounded, it's not by, the same. It's not the same. You know that. Yeah. So I want to just people probably wondering when you're home for the holidays and you're getting ready for a contest, you're obviously not cheating on your diet or anything, but are you kind of taking it easy or are you still trying to go like as hard as possible? I'm still trying to go. I mean, shit, we only have 10 weeks from today. I know. Until like yeah, I know. Tomorrow. So it's like, there is no easy, you know, I was thinking like, you know, this can kind of be a deload week on the joints a little bit. It's like, no, you can't, this is, it's yeah. a sprint now. So you just yeah. gotta give, give what you can. And what I had to do is like, I was at the, so the place I'm using for legs like you can only get five plates because their plates are like this big. Yeah, so like, yeah. You know, so it's like you can only get five plates per side on the hack squat. You can only get like ten plates. So like all my top set top sets are like sets of twenty right now. So it's the, it's <laughs> different, you know. At least you're confusing the body a little bit. Um, I'd have to ask this question because came in, Nick. Can you ask Nick what he thinks his main game plan to defeat Big Rami is? Oh, you asking me right now? That's for Nick. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, he's um, kidding. Yeah, yeah, he can. I don't. I just have to improve in the areas that I have to improve on, like my legs, my chest, and just oh. overall refinement. And I, oh. you know, I, I, I out conditioned him already. So yeah, yeah. I'll fucking answer for you. If you look okay. anything like the photo you posted, you'll beat Big Rami. What do you mean? That's real. What do you mean? If I look, I do look. No, like no. That. I mean, like if you get on stage looking like oh, that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's fucking. That's can I, crazy. Can I just say something for being at the Olympia backstage and looking at like, obviously with a bed gentleman? Yeah. My my top two was like from what I saw honestly, and this is not trying to discredit anyone. My top two was Hardy and Nick. Yeah. Because of the condition factor, like condition, especially yeah. they set themselves apart there. And they I think were actually. Sorry, go ahead, James. No, I was just saying, I just think, you know, I'm, I'm a stickler for people being in good shape. And these boys were, they were inside out and they had H- Hardy was required. a creep, man. Yeah, Hardy looked great. So a lot of people after the show said Hardy should win this and that. And I was trying to justify like the way the judges had it or trying to explain what I thought the judges had. Mm. The longer time has passed and the more I've looked at it, I'm like, I'm not saying it should have gone any other way, but I do see things kind of the way you do, James. Like, the way, because Hadi and Nick had a different look than right. every than everybody else. Can I can I jump in? Yeah, um, of course. If they re, if they reward Hadi as first, then Nick has to be second. Then Nick has that's, to be that's, second. That's, yeah. yeah, that's why. If they're, I, if yeah. they're yeah. judging, yeah. if they're yeah. judging it that way, and it's like yeah. if Hadi doesn't win, then Nick can't. Like, well, Nick yeah, yeah, yeah. was like one one yeah. two. But if Hadi was third, then yeah. Nick would have had been further back because. Yeah, yeah. They're rewarding other things, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And I, 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 I totally agree, and that's it's because my personal outlook is that. Yeah, but I also, why, yeah, yeah. But I also think to myself, people always think that, right? Like, oh, if the mask guy wins, then the second, third place, fourth, fourth should all be mask guys. It doesn't always work like that. Like sometimes always. you get you get a mask guy, right? Like Rami. Then you get an aesthetic yes. guy like Brandon. <clears> and you, get a, <throat> you get a conditioned guy like Hottie. They're all well, Brandon is Brandon is massive. Yeah. Well, like, but not I, not Rami. <laughs> But is he Rami? But, but, but no, no, but Rami. no but but his thing, Rami. if you, if you take Rami, Brandon, and Hardy, it's like a progression through from the size to the yeah. condition. I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, like yeah. Brandon's kind of in between the two. Of yeah. Them. yeah, 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 yeah. That makes sense. You know? Yeah. Um, Bronislav Stevanich. Sorry if I messed that up. Can we finally ask Brett if he celebrates both Christmases because of Ivana? What does that mean? Both Christmases. What does that mean? I, I don't know. I don't know if that's re- referring to because she's Easter European or that, but they, I'm pretty sure they celebrate the same Christmas. 
I'll have to ask. Yeah. <laughs> Bra- Brana's love. If you can elaborate on that, maybe we'll. Yeah. yeah. No, they don't. I mean, she also moved here when she was six years old, though. So it's oh, more, so- much more traditional for the American. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So her culture celebrates a different kind of Christmas. She's never mentioned that. That's the first time I've ever heard that. Oh, okay. All right. I don't think that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure if there was another chance for us to get other presents. Right. Place, I would, I would hear that. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> uh, this guy asked, did Rich Piana ever make it to the Olympia stage? No, he didn't. Rich Piana was never a pro, right? I don't think he turned pro, no. no never he turned pro. He, he, um, he, he looked good as an amateur. Right? He Maybe. placed pretty high at the Nationals, I think. Yeah, there's a couple of years where he did look pretty yeah, fucking good. I thought he had a freaky physique, but I don't think he could he could put it all together. Plus, some of the classes he were, he was in were really competitive. Yeah, it was good years. Yeah, it was yeah. years where there was some really good bodybuilders. Yeah, but aside from that, I think, and this is off topic, obviously, but I think Rich Piana did a ton for bodybuilding. Loads before Loads. before anybody I, I else. Was, I was having this conversation because the first time my ex was with Five Percent, so the first time I met him was the 2015 Olympia, mm-hmm. and I was kind of lucky enough just to hang out with. Him. I was like. This is where, like, the year I, Luke and I always started to train together, and so it was, like, for real low-key. That man, for all your opinions over here, was the most, one of the most genuine, he didn't care who I was, whether I had the following I had or one follower, he gave you his time, and then when you watched him work an expo, I can, only compare, work hard. I can only compare him to Jay Cutler. Mm. Like, would stop. Even when the expo was done, we'd be walking back to the car park. And and do you remember the, where the Vegas Convention Center is? And then the car park, it's a long fucking walk. Yeah. You, walk you were walking for like 30 minutes. He stopped for everyone, every single person, and had a genuine conversation with them. That guy worked. That Nick, sorry, you- I, I love it because we could hear Ben's train there. Sorry. Was, yeah. sorry. Did, you was have- that your train? Yeah. <laughs> I, I love that train. <laughs> Nick, do you, have that, do you have that going on or no? Do you feel but- that way? Like... Well, do you have that same kind of thing? Because it's, I feel like it's something that you either have or you don't. Like, are you, when you're at expos and stuff, do you kind of connect with people that easily? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. I enjoy talking to people. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not great at that, man. Like, I, I fucking don't have the, like, Jay Cutler can sit and talk to anybody for however long. I don't, I, it's very, very few people I could see that can do that. James, how did you feel at the Olympia, Meet the Olympians? I was just, you know, I was surprised. I was very happy with the turnout for me because I don't have the presence some of the other gentlemen have, and I was blown away. And I was, I, was, I made an, a big effort for sure, and I was happy doing that. And I tell you, it was fucking tiring though, but it was great. Like I, I like doing that side of it as well. And and knowing how fucking much energy it takes now, I'm going into another show like that, an Olympia, and be a little bit more prepared because yeah. it honestly was fucking exhausting. I didn't realize how bad like much it would take from you. Just um, standing there, you mean? Nick, Nick was wise. Nick was wise because I noticed you didn't get off your feet too much. Like, didn't get off your feet too much. <laughs> yeah, he was next to me. We were next to each other, and I kept standing up, and I was like, "Fuck, I should just sit down." Like what else? Could I tell you honestly? I remember um, an Arnold meet the meet the Arnold meet the meet the press or whatever it was. <clears throat> so I'm standing at the Arnold's back there, and I remember standing on my feet, like you said, the whole time. Mm. And I remember specifically my cheeks getting sunken in, just standing there, like the three hours or four hours we were there. I like got to, I was depleted just from standing there, like shaking hands and like talking to people. It's fucking so it actually, it takes a lot out of you actually yeah. when you're in the, when, you're, when you're in that state. So my, my Ridge Piana story, real guy, I want to tell this. Yeah. Um, my Ridge Piana story is, is this was probably in 2015, maybe 16. So I was just getting into this. Like I didn't know who he was at the time. And, you know, I was maybe 190 pounds soaking wet. We were just out there for Ivana. And I remember, you know, it was at the convention. I, can't, I had a phone call or something. So I go outside, like out front. So I left the expo. I go out front by the statue, by the Arnold statue. And then that, there's that main street. And all of a sudden I'm looking up and all the traffic is just stopped. Like uh, there's no traffic and everyone's honking. I'm like, what the fuck's going on? You know, because everyone's kind of like looking over there. So I walk over there and kind of look. And like in the middle of that main, that busiest street, probably in Ohio that day, you know what I mean, with the convention, he must have got out of his taxi or something. His bag broke. And so first of all, I never, I didn't know who he was. So I walk, I'm like, what the fuck is that? And like, it just looked like a gorilla was just picking up all these containers of like protein and like EAAs, throwing them in this bag. And I'm just like, what, what is that? Like, what is that guy? Like, it was like, this crowd was just all staring. Like, what the hell is that? Yeah, man. He was freaking in person, man. I mean, just the the arms all oiled up and stuff. It's just, I thought he was, (laughs) I thought he was taller in person though. I remember when I saw him, he was like, I think he was my height. 
I couldn't believe yeah, it. It was very tall. No. Yeah. No. Um, Josiah Williams says, Brett, back in 2016 through 2018, after the Chicago Pro, I met you and Ivana. Everyone was so rude to me and my wife, but you took the time. You too took the time <laughs> of day. Haven't felt that genuine care towards fans since John Meadows. That's nice. Oh, yeah. Uh, Austin Quinn says, should bodybuilders on gear get the vax? Just curious on y'all's perspective. I think my perspective is you should get the vax if you want to get the vax. It's a choice. Yeah. yeah just do, do, do whatever the do, fuck you want. Do if you, you want it, get it. Yeah. Uh, Anton Poe says, firm handshakes to James. Saw him pop up on the Docs channel a few times. What's that? Ah. What's, what's the Docs channel? Is that a gaming thing? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's a different world. Different world. Totally different world. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what the name that, that name is, but if you guys can work out with any 70s or 80s bodybuilders in their prime, who would it be with? Franco Colombo. Franco Colombo? Maybe. Brett, uh, or James? Not on Brett. I want to see, what was that guy? Serge, what was his last name? New Bray. New Bray. Yeah, like, he, wasn't he the one that, I, I just wanted to see what he did. They said he trained like three hours a day, like thousand reps of abs i just wanted to, i just want to see it not saying i really want to do it i just want to see him now he trained back then i'd like to train with uh lee haney no oh, yeah. say battle fox i i want to do uh blue Ferringo and his dad <laughs> yeah <laughs> Be in your ear, like. him and his dad. <laughs> I, I don't know fox because battle fox was just like they called him brutal battle fox he was just a fucking tank was it why did he train like crazy or something I think he was just a strong motherfucker. Just think he was uh, just me. Sam Preston says, "Hope everyone on the podcast and all the hostile crew have a great Christmas." And okay, you too. thank you very much. Thank you. Oh look, who's fucking? Oh coming. shit! Uh, he's fucking about to get oh, shit, oh, shit turned oh, upside oh, down now. Oh, he's chopping wood. He's <laughs> chopping wood, lad. Are you chopping wood, he's fucking, fucking asshole? Are you he's hunting? He's, He's never like settled, is he? <laughs> like sitting down. Hey, you should be. Off, you should be off that. You, you're too old to be on that leg. You need to get off that leg, man. What are you doing? Turn your phone. That's why. Yeah, there you go. Hey. Yeah. Turn your. Turn what your... are you doing, bro? Turn what? What are you doing out there? Are you chopping wood? He's cutting wood. Ah. Is this supposed What's to be a fucking? Off? Is this supposed What's to be a joke? Show? What there is this? He's like, look at me. He totally did this on. Doink. He's like, watch the power. I hope it hits the phone. Please come and hit the phone. <laughs> this Please motherfucker, fucking, you fucking prick. All right, here we go. Let's see. Sit. Doink. <laughs> oh, like a little, you totally split that. Like one little piece went the other way. He's gonna tell you he only wanted little pieces. How is this ending up? Us watching guy wood chop live. By the way, wood chop live. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna block his fucking media in a second. <laughs> like <that. laughs> ah, retard. <laughs> hey, you, you know that block of wood's like this big, right? I know. Right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you go. You got a good chop. There. Are, you, are you done now? You you done showing off? <laughs> no, he's made a seat. Are you trying to prove a point or something that you can chop wood? I'm proving a point that you know some of us got work to do. Why don't you go inside where your phone works instead of like it cutting he's, it out? He's such a jerk. What, what are you doing? He's such a jerk. <laughs> hey, I got another. I got another invasion for that. All right, bring him on. Hey, monkey, come here. You don't want anything to do with you until you got on that podcast. Oh, the big fella. Let's the ask Phoenix. Lad. Let's ask Phoenix what he thinks about this question. People. Including, oh, look at that. I wish I had hair like that. Um, hi, people, hey, including that's, pros. That's, hi, go ahead, Jay. go ahead, Ben. The, these are your druggy uncles, druggy, <laughs> Drug- <laughs> <laughs> the junky uncles. <laughs> we give you the best presents, though. <laughs> Fuck you, I'm natural. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, natural. I'm natural now. Come on, come on, come on. Go to mama. Yeah. I'm better than all you guys now. I'm natural. <laughs> yeah, I get to be I, I get to take the, the moral high ground. Um, people, including pros, that superset using two machines at the gym during peak hours, douche or no douche? No douche. No douche. I do that. As long as you let people work. As long as you let people work. Hours out. though. If I gotta do a superset, I gotta do a superset. 
Do you let people jump in if you're doing it? Sometimes. Like if they got to do their set, like after you're no done. one's jumping in with Nick doing a superset. No, no one, everyone's no, doing no. clear of that guy. <laughs> <laughs> no one, no one was asking, can I work in? <laughs> um wise guy was showing off. We get it. It we get it. He's hot. This guy thinks guy's hot. Huh? I don't know. Oh, no. Why is the log bigger than guy? <laughs> For Nick, when are you coming to Southern California? I don't know. Oh, this guy, so, this guy says TRT. Who's that guy? I don't know. That was, uh, I don't know. I can't pronounce the fuck. It's B-L-V-C-K. Oh. I don't know. Um, this guy says TRT isn't Natty Fouette. I'm not doing it. <laughs> I'm totally off everything this week. Are you? Yeah, this week. It's, it's been <laughs> Since Monday. Since Monday, I've been off everything. Got a shot. <laughs> uh, how do you, each of you guys sleep comfortably at night being heavy? I'm 250 pounds and find it really hard to sleep without having hip or neck pain. I sleep like body a baby. Pillow. Body pillow. I have to sleep mm-hmm. with a full... I took, I took one to Brett's, actually. I put it in my suitcase, like a full body pillow. Wow. You took a full body pillow on a like in the suitcase? <laughs> yeah. Would you have a spare suitcase just for your body pillow? No, it's like it folds up into half of the suitcase. Now like I know here, I can fit in the two case. There's one here. Look, there's one here. Show it to this me. Is it was that big. I was so fold in half. And then you fold it. So you literally have a carry on. Just that's, a, that's a literal whole fucking suitcase. Yeah. <laughs> no, it take, it, no, it takes up. <laughs> no, no, no. You know, you have a suitcase and one half of it is zipped up and yeah. the other half is open. That goes in the open half. If it's, uh, you know. I don't know. Man. That's the whole suitcase. But that, but that's, that stops me from like. Well, he, was the borrowing, he was borrowing my clothes when he, he could be used to use it. Yeah. <laughs> he had to bring the pillow instead. <laughs> right, that, you, just need, you just need a good bed. Do you know what I mean? Like a decent bed instead of a shit one. Wait a second. I got a question. How many people, and don't say anything, guy. How many people here think guy can do 100 push ups? Yeah, easy. James? Easy. Brett? Oh, easy. Right, easy. Wait, wait, wait. Without tearing He's a muscle. Right. Enough, <laughs> Without tearing a muscle. Yeah, I don't know. He might. <laughs> Nick, <laughs> Nick, what do you, Nick, what do you think? <laughs> Absolutely not. Nick doesn't think so. No. Nick, do you know, it depends on the form. Nick's not fucking stupid. So we just. <laughs> I don't like that. Hey, don't call Nick stupid. If it's CrossFit press ups, yeah, easy. If it's fucking. Yeah, I didn't want to use press ups. Nick, I was going to use the R word, but I knew I'd get like canceled. I'm surprised <laughs> that James and Brett. Bought it, spot into it so easily. Yeah, I, easily. I think if you challenge him to something, he's not gonna. He, he'll get it. If he okay. does, James is on my side too. If he's at like eighty and he knows he's, not gonna, say- make it, he's gonna blame it on his quad, he'll just like roll over and say, oh. <laughs> "Brett, how do you jump to my fucking on my side and then just and then just show turn me. around and stab me? Way, either way, you're gonna win. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a win if I say my legs far. That's a draw. It's a draw. So you still <laughs> never seen guy do a full rep of anything. That's, <laughs> that's, that's one of the guys. I didn't say it. That's, I didn't say it. That's one of the tr- You're gonna trigger the fuck out. Damn. He's on oh, one. It, was, it was had to be had to be Ben. This guy says if no, if it's guy, in the chat. If guy can do a hundred, prove it now. Yeah, this is live, guy. Oh. <laughs> good thing I we'll fucking. Good guys. thing I told him. Holy shit. <laughs> Oh, so he doesn't realize he just did the fucking... Are you serious? Yeah, you've been live. <laughs> <Covered live. laughs> when, where was the preface of the conversation? Hey, we're live. You think I didn't say anything stupid? I know, I know. Oh, oh. my God. <laughs> yeah, there's no do I was That's like podcast 101. You don't do that. Well, I it's thought like you could tell when you... somebody on speaker, not telling them they're on speaker. You yeah, don't but do like that. When, you, when you log on, it says live on YouTube in the top left corner. Yeah, I got live. Say that. Everybody sees it. Oh, you go on your computer. <laughs> well, you got all right. To be, to be fair, you got to touch the mouse. Oh, sorry. That's <laughs> my, my fault. Okay. Anyway, we're live. Don't worry about it. So you just chop wood live. It's good. I... <laughs> it <was> chop wood demo. <laughs> so, guy, I think since we're live, you should. And it's Christmas. I'm not, wanna... dude. I've been outside fucking <laughs> chopping oh, wood. Oh, here we go. I've been chopping wood. You Somebody dropped two crying. pieces of fucking wood and the game in. Yeah, you chopped two pieces of wood. That's all it was. I've been outside for two hours cutting grass and chopping oh, wood. Oh, okay. This it's is like the anchor man when he's like 1004. 1005. I'll do it. I'll film it. I can, I no, not, you don't have to film fresh. it. We're, we don't have to film it. We're live right now. Just turn the camera down a bit and do your push ups. I'm not just going to do push ups after fucking walking inside. I'm freezing cold. Oh, this is I cool. you up. 
it will warm you up. You'll get nice and warm. Turn your, turn your and that's what I thought about you. doing 20 reps on a leg. <laughs> <laughs> too, Ben. Ian, turn your phone. It's sideways right now, though. Yeah, you still well, your, screen, you your screen lock. Turn yeah, your you screen lock off. My screen lock's not on. Oh, it should go back then. It should it should go horizontal for you. Uh oh. Do, do, do. Guy, what are you doing for Christmas? Hanging out with your family? Yeah. What? Oh, we. Hmm. Guy, I think I have to go kill a lamb tomorrow. I might need you. Do you? Why? With that, you got to slit its throat. Yeah, probably. I might. <laughs> why is that like? It... Why? That's serious. We do it every Christmas. So Ivana's side, they they roast the lamb for Christmas, and then the Christmas Eve morning, we go. I go out with her brothers, and we fucking tackle one and slit its throat. And I'm just saying there, like. That's hardcore. <laughs> hey, yo, guy, why, why are you wearing so much clothes in your house, guy? <laughs> he was outside chopping wood a minute ago, live, outside, live I mean, on I thought, YouTube. I thought it was going to be like a quick, like, in and out. He was like, can you interrupt at 3.30? I thought it was like a quick two-minute interrupt, and I was out. No, no, you're here for good now. No, nah, once you're in, you're in. What's good? Well, who knows? Good. Whatever, until we get bored. Um, this is basically our Christmas. And my training Christmas partner theater. is outside finishing the yard. <laughs> <laughs> Ian, how are you, man? Good, you? Good. Are we, uh, are we all going to meet up in Dallas or what? Yeah. I said I would. Dallas, Dallas. James, when are you, you going to be back in the U.S.? James, you have no idea? I don't know yet, man. I don't know yet. I'm just... looks like a 17-year-old biker playing fucking skateboard games on his computer. That's basically <laughs> what I am. I was just playing Call of Duty before this. I've literally just signed out just to join you boys. But uh, I don't know when I'm going to be back in the US yet because it's all been done, but I'm not in a rush. I'm just chilling, man. I'm just like, oh, training's good James, here. I'm back in my gym. I feel good at the minute. James, James, come back and revisit my casa. I know, I know, I know. But I know when I'm back out there, that's it. I'll be out there for a long, long time. So I'm kind of just soaking it up while I'm here. Nick, so, blink. So who's it going to be then? It'll just be me, Guy, Brett, and Ian? Well, fuck you! Why? That's I'm a good cast. cast. Oh, you're, you're, are, you're already you're already there, Ben. We're That's a good cast. <laughs> if you guys come to Texas and don't invite me, we're we'll pissed. <laughs> <laughs> come in your backyard and say fuck, Ben. Yeah. Um. All right. So we on the other on the other podcast we did a RB, the RBP awards, and I wanted to get everybody else's opinions. Whatever one I'm in, I win. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say. <laughs> well, most like, annoying. Most cocky. <laughs> not me. That's not me. He's, he's likely to blink during an episode. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what happened here to my shit? Okay. Um, this you know what James looks like with his how his camera and stuff is? He looks like he'd be someone that you'd come across on like Omegle or like uh, chat roulette, <laughs> you know? <laughs> Yeah, James, point the camera down. What you got below there? You, better <laughs> pan, you got pants on, right? <laughs> After that, got some bombs on. Right. Okay. A bit chilly in there. Uh, no. Nope. Either way. Oh, Ooh, mate, it's just boxer shorts. Here we go. Um, fan favorite, biggest fan favorite of 2021. Me. <laughs> Well, okay. Me, Ian, and, and Guy, and Roman did this. We have Nick and Hottie. Is there anybody else we need to add to the list? Me. I said you already. <laughs> He's on me again. I'm saying Hottie. Nick, I'm saying... you know what? Nick would suck his own dick if he could. Yeah, but mm, who wouldn't? I wouldn't go that far. Wait a minute. Who wouldn't? I yeah, you, whack, you, you beat it off. You beat it off because you, you beat can. it off. You wouldn't. Suck it if you could. You're sucking your I own wouldn't dick. know. What? I well, why not? Well, I, I would. <laughs> why not? Is that gay? Is that gay? Yeah, right? It's not gay. It's not is it gay. gay? Is it gay? No, it's got to be. It's not gay. It's a gay. No way. That's gay, bro. It's still a fucking penis, dude. Yeah, but the problem is. Yeah, absolutely gay. Anything, anything, like, anything, wait, anything I do, anything I like do to myself. That's like saying if you jerk off. That's like saying if you jerk off, you're gay. Yeah. No, 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 no. No, Why listen, not? listen, listen, having this, like, enjoying having the shape of a fucking penis in your mouth is a different story. Because you have no, enjoy it. I'm not enjoying it. No, no, no. James, you're missing. But I don't enjoy it when I jerk off. I'm not, wait. Yeah, yeah I'm not. I don't you enjoy it. Wow, this dick feels so good in my wait, hand. Let ben, yeah. let ben, <laughs> wait, let Ben, wait, James, let Ben finish. Yeah. You're my, looking my, at it. You're looking my at dick does feel good in my hand. You're worried about what it feels like in your mouth. I'm worried about what my dick feels. 
I'm enjoying that side. Yeah, of but it depends what sensors are stronger. Like my mouth's probably more sense. <laughs> sense hey, aware look, here, here, we got to add it here. My training partner just walked in. All right. If you oh, could, okay. no, hey, wait, so wait, hey, wait, kid. No, wait. that was not. That was not. Just wait yourself. a minute. Wait. Training partner of guy. If you could suck your own dick, would you do it? <laughs> <laughs> Ian, Ian, would you do it? I'd try it. Yeah, I'd try it. You're crazy. You don't. You don't have to go back out. You know? I reckon everyone's already fucking tried James, it. James, would you try it? <laughs> no. Who used to say Ivan when I was younger? No, but if you could, would you? No. <laughs> If, if I was alone and my missus ain't in and I need to... Well, of course. I'm not like, do it in well, front of my fucking wife. Like, guy, you are going to... Guy's going to tell you... Are you going to cut it in your mouth, too? No. no. Yeah, but if it's you not going to cut my mouth. Fuck your own cock and then your wife can play with your ass. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, Rabbit you're hole. not going <laughs> to... You're not going to finish <laughs> blowing your own load in your mouth? I just That's said I'm not going to... That's I'm not going to... That's like a human... What are you doing? What do you mean? Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. That's like the human centipede. One second, Nick. Uh, what did you, what did you say? You, what did you say, Nick? What? You're saying, you said, are you going to come in your own mouth? And I said, no. Yeah. What's the point yeah. then? Pull out. No, I don't want to come in my own mouth. Oh my God. Yeah, okay, okay, listen, 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 listen. What are you going to put No, wait, wait, wait. When a, yeah, when I'm girls... going to fucking take my mouth. Yeah, exactly. Wait, and hang you're on. Gonna finish, you can you're going to come on your face. <laughs> <laughs> you might as well just fucking the work off then. You know? Wait, what's the worst bit when a girl's giving you head and she pulls off as you're about to come? Is that not annoying as shit? No, That's I don't necessarily worst. mind that. I'm good. No, nah, I don't, I don't like, like keep going. Apples. Yeah, keeping I'm going is good too, but I'm just saying I'm okay. I don't get upset. Keeping going is way better. Of course. Yeah. I agree yeah. it's better. Yes. I agree. I'm, with I'm fuming if you can't blow your load in the mouth. <laughs> fuming, he said. Or, or, or it's, the same thing as, no, it's the same thing as you're banging a chick and you're about to come and she jumps off and does it with, finishes off with your hand. That, like, you're that, a would, that, would, that would really. <laughs> well, wait a minute. What's well, the wait, so hold on. Yeah, Maybe I don't, I don't enjoy blowing your load while taking it I'll at the same time. Wait well, a minute. Hey, it, in for a penny, in for a pound. If I'm doing, if my dick's in my mouth, it's going all the way. Yeah, but maybe well, I, I might, don't have, might have a point. Maybe, <laughs> maybe I don't want a cream pie though. What if you Why? don't? But what if I don't want a cream pie? What if I want to do something else? <laughs> then cream, pie your, cream pie would be in your asshole. No, I'm saying, fuckhead. If she, he said, if a girl's riding you and she gets off, that sucks. And I'm like, not always. Yeah, what if always. she, what if she gets always. off? And she yeah, wants, no, what if, yeah, what if she gets off? What if she, no, man. What if she gets off? She's like, come on my face. Okay. Awesome. No. No, it doesn't feel better though. It's just cool because you oh, react. But it's great. Yeah, it's cool. yeah, that's just, that's just like cool that's to be like this. Cool. It's not actually. Good. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's all visual. What's wrong with you guys? That's all seriously. Shit. Why it do you want it? Feel bad. Who had? Why do you want to demean women like that? <laughs> that's, the, that's the best. <laughs> yeah. it, could be, it could be coming on her tits. It could be coming on her tits. That's also like, good. Like coming, coming. Yeah, like yeah. No. <laughs> As opposed to what? Nobody got the super bad reference, y'all. Yeah. Oh, I got it. <laughs> All right. God, so, so wait a minute. Out of the six of us, who's sucking their own dick if they could? We're all fucking doing it. Don't lie, boys. I know these guys yeah. are trying to act hardcore. Nick for I sure. Not sucking my Nick. Dick. Brett, wait, Nick. Brett's not said a fucking word. Fuck this. I know. Time out. <laughs> I would see if I would see if my if, if it, my head would reach, and then that would be enough. Oh, to sure it would. Yeah. Okay. okay. All right. It all right. sounds pretty. That's enough here, hey, to hey. me. Squatty potty code mutant 20. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, do you know what the thing is? The problem is just because you can doesn't mean you should. But you will. Because because it's like that's I'm, not, me. I'm, I'm like that's like fucking me sucking Ben's cock. No, it's not. No, yes, it is. It, no, it's yes, not. If it you is jerk, I could. James, if you jerk off, it's not like you're jerking off Ben, you're jerking off your own dick. Yeah, James, you remember that time it was totally different. <laughs> it didn't mean anything. It's the whole. I it's, think it's the, it's the jizzing part at the end. It's where the jizz goes. The problem. I'm almost positive. Guy and Nick are both going to do it. They're just too no, scared. scared no, no, I'm not, both not going to do nothing. A 100 percent sure. <laughs> just because you're weird doesn't mean I'm weird. I'm not weird. Ben and fucking Ian are weird. Yeah, I'm like the weirdest one, and I'm not sucking my dick. That's yeah, why I think you're for sure doing it. Fucking, I, I can't even wait out. Okay, it's just. <laughs> If you could, you totally would at least fucking try it. Come on. Yeah, I said I would see if my head would reach, and that would be enough validation. Okay, and what if it did? If it did reach, then what? You what would, you would, you'd go, like, oh, I can get there. He, he, I can hey, get ben, there. Ben, That's cool. ben, Ben, he would be like, oh, that feels good. Oh, I'm not going to do it. Yeah. yeah. No, 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 no. <laughs> what if you accidentally 
I wouldn't fuck. My mouth would not be ever touch my penis. Get out of here. What is the tip? <laughs> 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 I can see him doing like a I can see him doing like a taste test. I'd be like, <laughs> 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 that's what I would do. I'd be like, what is the tip? What is the tip? Like, 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 what is the you know, that's a bit. Why? But why is it suspect? Like, imagine like like licking your own fucking bell end. Like, but you jerk off your you jerk off yourself. What's the difference? Yeah, but that's like that's like it's know, not it's the same. The same. Yeah, why is it not the same? If you jerked off another dude, if you jerked off another dude, that'd be weird. You're not sucking it, man. Yeah, but you jerk like, it off. Change my mind on this one. Men that I'm like to you, suck other cocks. Will suck don't their like, own as well. I don't. I don't like to jerk off. I'm like, oh, I can't wait to go jerk off. Oh, you do like to jerk off. Shut no, up. it's more like out of this. Like, so okay. Lincoln's fun. Know. Lincoln's cool. It's it's crazy. Crazy. Okay, wait a minute. How many people here love jerking off? Like, it's like, oh, I, I can't love wait. It, but listen, if I have to empty the ball sack, it's got to be done. Yeah, but that's out of necessity. It's not because exactly. it's like more it's more enjoyable. But yeah, sucking so, my own cock is not necessity. That's because you like it. You're a bit odd. That's like, oh, I fancy being a bit a bit cheeky, a bit slimy today, and sucking your own dick. Like imagine that's your own like your dark secret. Yeah, like like this guy. Yeah, you know? that guy's the one like sucking his own dick. I'm just saying. I think if I tried it and it felt good, I don't think I would stop. That's all I'm saying. It's, would you? Uh, if you if you actually I mean, could and you did, would you admit it? Yeah. All right. Let me let me ask. Lion sack of shit. Why not? You're I don't no, think. Like, I think. It, I I, I just think blew it's... the biggest load in my own mouth. Today. I didn't say I would do that. <laughs> <laughs> guys, 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 guys. Look, if I, if I, look, on this camera, yeah, let's say I was just wanking off to you lot now, yeah? Is that gay? Gross. Gross. Yeah? Yeah. But what did he say? More, is it even more gay if I'm sucking my own cock while you don't watch? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I, find that even, I find that even more gay. It's it's only gay if you're gay. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, man. Hello, True. man. Ian's Hello? right. Like, so what? So like, I, I fucking I, can't, I can't. Wait. So if Yannicka puts if Yannicka puts a strap on them and fucks my asshole, no, that sorry, not gay. No, 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 that's, that's not, not gay. gay. No, it's not gay. That's your wife. It's a I'm woman. not into that though. I'm not into that shit though, man. Okay, wait, 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 Okay, no, wait, I'm gonna miles. fucking miles with a dildo or a fucking strap on. <laughs> I'm gonna ask the authority. Watch, I'm gonna ask the authority on this. If that goes in your ass, bro, you're like you're fucking something. Okay. And he's in bed. Roman's on my team. Roman is my team. Like a shark. Look at Roman. Roman, I have a very important question for you. Okay. If you could reach and you could suck your own dick, would you? I would try. My would man, you, if you knows. could, if you could, and you reached, and it was, was all there, would you Perfect. finish? Would you open mouth and engage? <laughs> Probably yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so European, that, they do things Ro- Roman, Ro- not, Roman. not even, not even probably for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Roman. Listen to this. Roman, so, you're such a shoe in sometimes. Wait, wait, so, wait, wait, wait. We're not done. Roman, is it gay to suck your own dick? No. <laughs> See? He's, a, he's certain of it. He's certain. Okay, I'm going like, to try no. it. If it's not gay, I'm <laughs> trying. <laughs> James, I'm trying. <laughs> Fuck it, I'm trying. You've said enough now. James. I'll, I'll James, gonna turn around I in just, the chat. James, I just saw your pictures. You're not reaching, man. I'm telling you. Yeah. <laughs> no way. Uh, I'm quite flexible. <laughs> I don't care. Holy oh, fuck. It fuck. ain't that long. So, Roman, listen to this. Tell Which me was. if you believe this. Guy, James, and Nick, all three said they wouldn't do it. I want to do it. When did I say I was doing it? Brett, you do it. You do it for sure. I can tell you. No, he wouldn't. That. No, he wouldn't. And I would make Brett, sure. Brett's not that. sucking his dick. Friends don't let him. friends suck their own dicks. Yeah. If I, if I, if out of the three of the, out of the four of them, I think Nick's lying the most. I agree. Fuck you, man. I'm not saying. <laughs> you know what I would do? I would suck my own dick and then make out with Fuad. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck was wrong with you? Why did you have to make... Guy, why did you have to turn this gay? I know. What the fuck's wrong Listen, with you? Listen, if you're going to go full... You might as well go full gay. Yeah, ben, don't, ben, don't go half. It's only gay if you're gay. True. Uh, yeah, totally. <laughs> if, I'm totally... If, if he's that's... not trying to be gay by making out with Fuad, then he's not gay. True. You know? So does that mean if I'm really not like if you have a girlfriend and you're really not trying to cheat but you bag another girl, <laughs> it means you really didn't cheat. Uh, it doesn't work that way. No. Well, no, like this. What about K? If you're in prison for 25 years and you haven't seen a piece of tail in like two decades and you fucking do it in the ass, are you gay? No. Yes. No. As soon as you do their ass. Yes. <laughs> yes. If you're if you're giving, maybe not. Yeah. If they fuck your ass, you're. This is like a pitcher catcher kind you're of thing. Flamboyant yeah. If they fuck your hey. ass. 
Hey, I, ho- I hope my son never sees this. <laughs> <laughs> well, he will. <laughs> he does make sure he's about the same age as you. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. I think we should put a disclaimer here. We have nothing against any homosexual acts. We just no, we're just it. trying to decipher. No, unless they've done because it to me. Because we're, 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 so, we're all so straight here. We're all so straight. I'm Apparently so not. Got to work out who's not. Um, <laughs> who's the most likely to go the other way? Is that one of the awards? Who's the most likely to go the other way? I think you should be. What kind of fucking award is that? (laughs) (laughs) No, Nick. Nick, That's a good one to talk about. (laughs) Nick just claimed he wins every award that he's involved in. That's right. I don't don't want to. Well, hey, there's three Sixters, eight of us on. Who, Who do you guys think would be the most likely out of this eight? I think Roman. I mean, I'm I'm Roman. I, was Roman. I was gonna say Roman too. It just kind of seems like he would be like, oh, but it wouldn't that. be gay. But it wouldn't be gay if Roman did. No, no, it Roman would be, would be totally, totally fine with it. It'll be, it'll be, be oh, it'll be, it'll be bye. Yeah, because he's a man of all people. Okay, answer this question then. To put it on the other side, <laughs> to put it this way, what if two girls fuck each other for a guy? Like, say you're having a three way with two girls, and one girl eats the other girl's box. Is she now a lesbian? That's no, she's now movie. awesome. That's just that's just great. <laughs> <laughs> she's a rock star. That's just that's just perfect. Uh, I don't know. I've always that. asked for that. <laughs> I think she's she's bi. Why? But no. No. I love Melissa. I didn't know she was here. We struck a chord. We struck a chord. Melissa. She's very she's defensive de- over that. She's definitely oh, bi. Melissa's done. She's definitely. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Women are freaky, man. Women get up to some funky shit. If a girl, um, if a girl goes down on other girl in a threesome, yeah, it's definitely bi. But why? You're only you're only bi if you're bi, man. Like you can't. I, I don't think that works. No, no, you don't I get don't to. You don't get to girls. Wait a minute. You don't get to choose if you're bi. If you yeah, eat nah, a pussy, you, you, if you're you, a girl you, and you eat a pussy, you're bi. No, I'm, incorrect. No, wow. I don't think so. I don't incorrect. think so. I don't think that rule applies. Listen, to unless you're forced. If you enjoy eating a pussy. And you enjoy but, sucking a dick. Who you're bisexual. Who says you're enjoying it? Who well, says you're enjoying it? Yeah. You're just doing it because you're having a threesome, and the guy would like it. Well, if you're doing it reluctantly, then that's fucking rape. If it was no, kind of like, <laughs> you're doing it. No, I get what Ian's saying. You're doing it, but you're doing it because he's trying to please the guy. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so you're not enjoying it at all. You're like, I'm just gonna eat. You're this apathetic. Box. You're apathetic to it. Hmm, I don't know. <laughs> Somebody's so enjoying deep. it. It's too deep. If a guy if a guy sucks a cock, he's gonna either he's enjoying it. He's like, I'm just gonna do this because my light wife likes James, it. James, I'm like, just staring at you, <laughs> bro. Because I'm fucking wait, lost, bro. Wait, I want to know. I'm gonna get my THC out. Okay, wait. Why, let me why, get, let me get James. Why has James got a knife? By let the me way, get... <laughs> I was eating steak. I promise. Let <laughs> me get James. <laughs> I want to get James. I want to get James' opinion. James. Yeah. If two girls, if a if a, if it's a girl, two girls and a guy are having a threesome, and a girl eats another girl's box, is she bisexual or not? There's a percentage. Like, yes. whether it's a ratio, there's a percentage. There's a little bit of them that fancy checking it out. Yeah? Mm. And that's enough to say, I'll cross the line. Because if you were totally against something, you wouldn't do it. So you're by. So if I was, yeah, because the only way I was fucking in your cops, a percentage of me was a little bit on Wanted that side. To. True. Yeah, a little, a little bit, you know, like, ah, fuck it, let's put it in my mouth. Yeah, Ian. <laughs> yeah, Ian, if you, were, if you were with Melissa and you were having a threesome with another guy, and she's like, I want, well, you, to I that, that, but... oh, and I want you to suck that cock. Would Ian, you if like, I say, okay, please, for you. Hey, you sucking dick? Ian, suck this, please. You would only, no, do, it. It. You would only do it if you kind of wanted to. Please. please, everybody, I'll tell you. Please. <laughs> please. No, I wouldn't do it, for sure. Because you're Open not, your you're not by. Open your mouth, Ian. Do it now, you bastard. <sighs> you're not you're like, wait a minute, because I got him here. What's up? I got him here. Wait. Oh, God. What if he's really like, I got him. What if he's really pretty? What if he's really pretty? <laughs> yeah, what if he's really pretty? Yeah, but no, pretty the flip side, what if we're having a three way and it's to me and another guy and you, yeah. and you ask me to suck the guy's dick? But that would oh, me but say it would. What if it didn't? Yeah, what if it didn't? Well, if you did it because you thought it was going to turn me on, I don't think that makes you gay. No, it makes him bi. Why? No, no. Because, <laughs> it, because unless he. Well, I'm not doing it on my own accord, like in private. But you are, though. You're physically doing it on your you own. You are. You're like, all, oh, you're no, not, hold on. Hold on. Why is it found? Sorry. Why is it found? You know, found. Oh, sorry. 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 You know <laughs> the scene? You know the scene I'm picturing right now? You know the scene in Get Hard where fucking Will 
Farrell's in the bathroom. And he's like, I'm just going to suck a dick. I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to suck a dick. I'm going to do it. I'm just going to suck a dick. I'm just <laughs> it's like, I don't know, man. Take it in That's what I think is happening. It's it's like, like, I, 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 I. Brett, he throws Brett, up. Oh. Brett, what do you think? I ain't, no, we ain't doing that. What do you mean? No, no, I'm not asking. Listen to me. I'll repose the question. <laughs> no, no, Brett. I got it. No, yeah, no, that's. If you're with two girls and one girl says, <laughs> if you want me to eat this box, I will eat this box. And she does. Is you, Do you consider her bi or she's still straight? I would say go straight unless she continues to do that acting because she likes it. So like Ian said, it's it's if they, oh, so you get one chance. They enjoy it. Yeah, you get, you get, I mean, they get a trial run. You get one shot. Are you ready? I think 90% of girls would have no problem eating another girl's box where I don't even think that's even close with if guys if it was reversed. I agree. That's why I don't yeah, think, I agree that's, that. why I don't think, that's why I, I don't think this applies to women as much as guys. <coughs> Roman, what do you think? Is it by? I think James is right. It's a It's a percentage. It's not so it like could a, be like twenty percent buy. Yeah, and the more you yeah, like it, the higher the percentage. Percent it's not like a, it's not like a light switch, like on or off. Uh, it's like a, he's right. He's like right. A, like a dimmer. Roman is a sexual Yoda. He is. Roman. <laughs> uh, Logan Slocum says, "I am sending this because truly, you guys make me who I am. I love everything each and every single one of you do. You inspire me every day. My dream is to make it pro, but a milestone is to." Personal, personally talk to you guys. Thank you. Thanks, Logan. Thanks, Logan. Legend. Um, let, us know, let us know how close you get. So, okay. So are, we are on agreement. There's a percentage. <laughs> I, can, I can agree with that. Okay. Thank God. See, we all agree on something. That's good. <laughs> um, okay. Are we going back to the RBP awards? Can we get through some of these? Yeah. Okay. But we did. That's all about Okay. I got Nick and Hottie for fan favorite. Is there anybody else you want to add? No, I think they're the top two popular right now like, in this point in time. Okay, most improved. I have Me. Brett. I have Brett. Shut up, Nick. Me. <laughs> I have Brett, Samson, Hunter, Regan, Ian. I think you'll go Brett because of the fucking jump in, in from since the last show. In. Like I, I have no. Everyone else has improved tremendously, but I think Brett's. Oh, the hold most, on, listen. We have. We, like, yeah. Whoa. Didn't we kind of discuss that? And we had other categories that he was in. That's why we didn't put him in that category. No, no, it's fine. But we're just just go one at exactly. a time, guys. So Brett's well, last show to this show was like, oh yeah, yeah, same guy. Is that the same person? So most improved. Uh, is there anybody other than those five guys I mentioned that you want to add to most improved? No, Nick, you got enough awards. Suck a dick. I'm just Nick, saying, I was the most improved. But... How are you the most improved? You're already at that level. People expected it of you. You weren't improved. You weren't like shit, and then you were well, good. It doesn't matter if it's expected. If I didn't perform, I didn't perform. But I performed. yeah, but if you, but if there you is were like, but it most improved is like you were not awesome, and then you were awesome. When so were you not? Brett awesome? said his Brett was the awesome year. The year. Wait, Nick, you got that last year. Not really, I only did one show last year. Kind of right, actually. You could add Nick to it because most improved from fourth in Chicago you, to you, you winning New York. Can. I went from yeah. fourth in Chicago to winning New York to winning the Arnold Top Five in Olympia. How's that not most improved? Okay, yeah, we'll add you. We'll add you to the list. He's got, he's got, he's got, he's got, he's well, we'll add you to the list, Nick. And then, but that I'm doesn't sh- mean that doesn't mean you're going to win. We have to all vote on this. That's list. fine. I should just be included. Okay, we'll include you. Feel left out, you bastards. Uh, best ambassador of bodybuilding. <laughs> <laughs> James, <laughs> most most fucking. <laughs> Best, best that, matter. Best ambassador in bodybuilding. Jay Cutler. Well, I think we said it had to be competitive. Active oh. pro. Men's active, open only. Active, active pro. Active? Men, men's open only. This is all men's open 2021. Is this for bodybuilding or like all categories? No, open men's, men's, bo- open no. men's bodybuilding. That's it. Men's physique. No. No, no one on the podcast for sure. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no. No. Well, we have what we have here is flex, Lewis. Oh yeah, yeah. Is he? But he's not an open guy. Uh, he is no, now. No, no he's, he's doing, doing the open. open. Yeah, he is now. So we have flex. But he Lewis. isn't yet. He hasn't done the open yet. He, he is when he steps off. on. Yeah, he's not an open yeah. guy until he steps on an open stage. That's true. <laughs> okay. Anybody else? Flex uh, Lewis? Okay. Breakout star of 2021. I have here. Nick Walker and Brett Wilkins. Wilkin. Uh, sorry, I forgot. I added, the S. I added the S by accident. 
Yeah, it's definitely it's gotta be it's gotta be it's gotta be Nick really, and top five first Olympias just retarded. Yeah. Uh, uh, this, guy said, this guy says James and the Arnold, is a pretty good Arnold win. Wait, wait. This guy says James is a pretty good ambassador. Should we add James as ambassador? No, I'm just love. some fucking UK twat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you, you put a you put a you put a good face on bodybuilding. You talk yeah. about it. I, I, I can try to. Let's add James to the list. Oh, we, nice can't, we can't add you. To nice list. To the list. No, I'm not allowed to be added. Ian said because I'm not. I'm, reti- I'm retired now, so it doesn't count. You did retire. So like three weeks ago, before I officially retired, I could have been added to the list. We'll come out of retirement today and then go I'm back. I'm coming in. out of retirement, yeah, Ian. <laughs> just, no. just for this podcast. You got to do a show. If we're saying it for flex, then you got to do a show too. Okay, okay, fuck. Um, okay, breakout star of 2021. I have Nick and Brett. Anybody else? For what? Breakout star of breakout 2021. Breakout star. Yeah. Okay. Other than back. that, uh, oh, he's the open guy. I was going to say the classic, you know, that. Urs. He's, you know, yeah, Urs. guy. We the only yeah. one. Um, best overall competitive season. I have Ian, Nick, Ian and Nick, and, and I have Nathan. Yeah, yeah, they've all smashed it. Because Nathan had three wins this year, and one was a yeah, bad. yeah. But I think my personal opinion is Nick had the best. I think Nick and Ian are closer than Nathan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, because the European shows aren't as deep as the American ones. Yeah, I can so tell I, you that because I've and, been there. And the and the Arnold US is obviously the the Arnold. Yeah. So I think, yeah, I think Nick Nick's got that one wrapped up. I think Nick has that one. And then, and then Ian's in a good cl- close, Ian's, definitely yeah. in a close second for sure. Most potential, I have Brett and I have Quinton. Yeah. I think you say Samson oh, somebody and- said, wait, wait, before we go on, somebody said, and I've gotten a few of these, Brandon Curry for best ambassador. Does anybody think that? I like Brandon. He's got <laughs> I don't see him. I don't see him too much. He's, 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 he's kind of quiet, right? Yeah, quiet, like, but when he sure does, out. but when he does post stuff about bodybuilding, seems very positive. Yeah, and, and he is a good, uh, like, he, yeah, he's morally great for bodybuilding. Yeah, like, yeah, he's, he's got, got a like family, a, a bad and stuff. Stuff. family. Yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, also, I wanted to add. What do you guys think of? I want to say Evan, but is Evan retired? Yeah, no, Evan, 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 Evan is, is he fully really retired? I don't I think, think so. I, I think Evan's retired, but I don't think he's officially retired. I think he's, he's just, not active. Yeah. Okay, so we'll move on. So most potential, I have Brett and Quinton. Anybody else you guys think of as potential, like coming up that we're not talking about? Uh, you could throw you could throw Samson in there. Yeah, Samson yeah, got a lot of Samson had a really good year. Yeah, I agree with that. Uh, you know, who I think has a lot of potential. That uh, who's that guy we were talking about? Ian, the, the the Arab guy, the Middle Eastern guy that just did to hey, third. Oh one. yeah. How about how about Regan? Baruz, isn't it Baruz? Regan's got a lot of potential. Baruz, I, yeah, I, I, I bet you, I bet you guys next year, Baruz right? is going to be is going to be something. That frame. What are you saying? He also can get Reg- we're saying, me and Nick said about Regan. Regan's got a lot of potential because he's such a, a large human. Like his frame is great. Regan has if, he, kind of potential. if he fucking get look, he's back. Like he's got a fucking. And I'm, I'm curious to see how he does now with Milo. So yeah, I think he's going to do very well. Did you guys? I want to just show you guys this quick, just so you guys can see if you guys see if you guys agree with me. I think you're going to see a lot more of this guy next year. Who is this? Baruz. Baruz. He, took just third, got... he took third in, uh, I think it was. Yeah. His conditioning was just nutty in that show. Yeah. yeah. Is he 212? No, no man. I he's know 250. He's 250. He's like 250, pounds. yeah. Oh, so really? somebody, some, one of his buddies went on like all my, like 50 of my pictures yesterday and commented his name. I don't know why. <laughs> This, I saw his name 50 times yesterday. Oh, he looks good. Yeah, he does. Look this, really good. This, this, is him. this is him next to I mean, he arguably could, arguably, really could have won the show. Yeah, yeah. side leg. Yeah. yeah. He's great. I, I think you're going to see this guy a lot more. So I don't know if we can. Oh, wait. Him. Ralph's got a Ralph's got lot of potential. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. But Ralph does have a lot of potential. Got a really nice, pleasing shape, isn't he? So we'll go to Brazil. It's the, Brazil with the, it's the Brazil with the Brazil genes, the good genes, man. Careful, careful, careful. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, shit, Ian's it. Fuck. Tread, tread <laughs> lightly, Ian. <laughs> okay. I didn't say nothing. Ralph. Uh, sorry, Ralph. Ralph. Not Ralph. Sorry, not Ralph. 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 That's what I used to call my cock. Ralph. <laughs> you called your cock Ralph? <laughs> when I was younger, man. Really? Ralph. When he was giving Ralph a little kiss. Were you trying to kiss him? <laughs> I, was, I never kissed Ralph. Oh, this guy said that. You know what? Somebody said this to me the other day. These these few people said Mark Hector. Oh shit. Oh Mark, Mark, yeah, no, Mark Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I think Mark Hector could be the biggest 
most potential out of all these people. Yeah, he's, he's like up a, there. He's, Where is he? He's under he's, the radar he's, right now. He's back. He's as prepping that with, He's prepping with Callum at the minute. He's, he's going to be doing. Uh, yeah. Yeah, he left Abdullah and it's gone with Callum Muscle Mentals. Mark oh, Hector was really, really impressive last year. He's, yeah. He's midsection. His midsection is yeah. like non-existent. And his back is super wide. It's mm-hmm. crazy. He's, 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 and he gets that condition that you don't often see on black fellas like that kind of color. Because I was having this conversation. I was having this conversation with a couple of guys about. It. I can't remember when. But it wasn't long ago because obviously he gets that like grainy. He gets that Caucasian dry. Like when he did the British with me. His glutes were like shredded, like a fucking like a European guy. Mm-hmm. And I said, because I speak to Mark quite a lot, and I was like so impressed with the condition because you don't see it often like that. Like no, that no. was incredible. Um, he uh, had the best of both worlds: muscle bellies, condition, size, small waist. If those legs are just a little bit bigger, fuck me, everyone's yeah. in trouble. Yeah, yeah. So this guy says uh, that Amir guy. Remember the Amir guy that did the European shows? Yeah, he's like, he's like twenty-two like, or something too. He's twenty-two. Yeah. He's got a lot of potential, but I think he's still further away than the other guys from cracking like the top placings at the bigger yeah shows. but that's still potential it's still potential okay well adam he'll I'll add that that's the last one because we got like six guys here so we're gonna have to narrow it down we got more we got eight guys here for potential so we'll have to narrow that down um okay next category is biggest upset i have ian beating kuklo i have roly taking fourth uh in tampa i have nathan taking fourth in Prague, mm-hmm. and i have sean cleary to winning uh, an open show. Sean Clarita. Yeah. That's yeah. the biggest one, probably, right? That's biggest, probably the like, biggest one. That's the yeah. one that hits people in the bollocks the most. Yeah. yeah. You know, if you were in that show and you didn't beat him, you'd be like, oh. Yeah, it's, and it's not even because it's he's a 212, it's because he's like the smallest 212. He's, he's like 170. Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. Fuck. Yeah. Fuck. Okay, yeah. so let's, let's go through these next ones quick, because I don't even know if I really like them as categories. So, uh, yeah. best best arms. I got Nick and Roly. Nick. How about Brandon? Brandon's got good yeah, arms, Brandon's too. Yeah. Good arms. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think he's got your fucking biceps, though, Nick, man. Yeah. And Nick, shut up. You're going to win Your biceps, when you do a fun day, just... <laughs> We can add him, though. Uh, best <laughs> legs. I got uh, best legs. I got Mo Shaban. I got Rami. And I got Quinton. I want to add Hottie to that. Yeah. Yeah, Hottie's got nice legs. Anybody else? Um... Okay, let's go move on from that. Best back, I got Phil Klahar and Justin Rodriguez. Justin Rodriguez. I think Rodriguez. I, have pronounce, I have to pronounce the R's. R, you you do the roles, roles, bro. Or, or do the roles. That's what they do in Norway. Thinking, People get upset. Upper back, like, upper back there or whole back side? No, whole back. I think Brandon's like Brad, back Brad, back. I legit thought you just had a cat on your shoulder. Yeah, no, it's fine, yeah. What? See, I can't oh, it's the cat was on his shoulder. Mm-hmm. Why, why, Brett? What are you thinking? Best back. Well, I think Brandon Curry has one of the best upper backs. Oh, that's true. That's that's right. Right. That's right. Like, if you're judging yeah. hamstrings and stuff, I don't think it's completely head to toe. Like, like yeah. Nick has probably the Yo, best. Yo, is this fucker about to jump up there? Backside, you know, on the bottom. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is your about to jump up there? What? I think it's just the frame. Oh, I got to add. Re- sure. Somebody, somebody said. Uh, Regan's back's good. Somebody said. Regan has a good back. That's right. Oh, yeah, Regan's got the same sort of insertions as like Derek Lunsford. Yeah. It was weird. It's bubbly. Yeah. Crazy uh, low lot insertions there. Okay. Uh, best chest. I have Akeem, Brandon Curry, and I got Hadi. Anybody best else? One? Chest. It's called, I think it's probably Akeem. What about Dexter? He oh he competed. That was last year. He is not active. Yeah. Okay. I think those are safe. <laughs> Unless you guys think of anybody else at the top of your head. And then I got best waist. Quinton. I got Nathan. I got uh Regan. Brandon Curry. Um, I got Regan. Regan. Lost you shows is crazy. One second, I got five here. I got Samson, Regan, Brandon, Nathan, and Quint. And I'm somebody was saying Curry, and I think Curry's a good addition. You could put even Hector on that list. Yeah, yeah Hector's crazy. is crazy. Hector, Hector is a good one too. Yeah. Okay, so we got. I wonder Brandon. how many of the Brits. I wonder how many of the Brits this year are going to do the UK Arnold. You doing it? Okay. I don't. I don't want that. I'm just. How wondering. about how about the most shredded award? That's a good one. Or, That's hard. Or, yeah. Most shredded probably goes to Hottie or Nick, I think, or Ian's fucking peeled as fuck all the time, too. Yeah, so Ian, but, but Ian is like sometimes he's hard, sometimes he's a little off. I don't know, James gets pretty, fucking too. I love how honest, I love how honest Roman is. He's like, 
Nah, he is off. He just like he's not uh, even there. I, I, yeah, but I, James, very, James I, gets I, that uh, Caucasian uh, dry up until the very dumb out. But oh, and James, deliver, right. I did, yeah, but I didn't deliver it to the stage. Yeah, but you one, yeah, but that one show. But I'm saying uh, your normal is inside out, like Caucasian well, dry. Can't, can't, but, but wait a second, guy. We're talking, and this is no offense to James, yeah. but we're talking about 2021. Yeah, and most stage. most peeled James is 2020, right? When he qualified yeah. for the Olympia, it was 2020. That was the oh. best best James, right? 2021, it was the Olympia, so it wasn't his best yeah. look. The best James was technically 17th of September this year, but it just didn't come to the stage. Yeah, yeah, that's right. <laughs> so <laughs> most shredded since, you know, Roman would have been up there too, but Roman didn't compete this year. Roman gets fucking uh, died. I think, it's, I think it's Nick. Hardy. Hardy. Uh, Ian. And then I think... How was Nick? Sean Clarita too, because he did an open show. Sean gets pretty fucking peeled too. Yeah. On, yeah. But he doesn't. Does he get? Does he didn't look as like as hard as Hani Hadi does, or yeah. or Nick? No, I think Hadi's harder. Yeah, yeah. I think Sean's shredded, but it's a different look. Did Lucas Oslidl compete this year? No, no, no. no he's usually really peeled. But he's but he is, but he's also hit and miss too. Funny, yeah. I've been yeah. I've been accused of uh, being biased to people on the podcast, and I'm like, it's not I my fault. That. It's not my fault the people on the podcast are fucking winning shows. Like, yeah, you know, I'm picking the people that are fucking winning. They just happen to be on the podcast. So, it's just such a fucking stupid poll. Yeah, yeah, suck poll. <laughs> Anyways, um, okay, last one. I can't see the hate uh, comments. I don't care. Last one, best coach. Matt. I'm yeah, gonna say Matt's, I'm gonna, Matt's, not, Matt's not Mr. Peak. I'm gonna say Never. Matt too. Yeah, I don't think like, I don't forever, think, however long. I don't even think there's another one in the category. I agree. Not for right. this. He, he has not literally missed the peak with anybody. No. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So we'll fucking have to narrow that down. Then I'm going to send out some awards to people. What should the what, are you RB, what should the RBP trophy like be like a like a, a log of shit? Yeah. Uh, yeah. A frame a a of us on here giving them the finger. No, I mean, we, we no, should get I'm... guys to just go, get guys to chop pieces of wood up for them. Yeah. <laughs> and engrave. No, Listen, I thought... you live no. in the fucking middle of nowhere, bro. You know what it's like. So I don't want to hear shit. I don't ben, chop a... wood. Fuck that. That's ben, just how, many, how many categories do we have? How many categories do we have? Uh, I don't know, like twelve. Oh, we don't have we don't have twelve people on the podcast, right? We don't have twelve. Why? You just want to make everyone on the podcast a winner? Yeah, no. Everyone. What, secret, secret Santa. Secret Santa. No, all the all the trophies should be one of our heads, like in gold. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I love a how bus. you go for the most expensive yeah. fucking metal. He's like, I know, right? Gold. Thanks, Roman. I got to pay for that. Yeah, not copper, <laughs> nothing like that. You'll straight. To Eddie, gold. you got those manscape money. You're no, I'm gonna, uh, like the, You know, like the the Joe Weider statue. He had like this. You know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I was thinking like. Uh, What's it called? Muscle and Strength sent out like anybody who got like one million view, views on their video. They sent out like a nice like vase thing or whatever crystal fucking sculpture. So I was like, I'm just gonna do that and just engrave it and just do it from now on. Just have the RBP awards. Yeah, do it. Cool. Yeah, I think it'd Fuck be cool. the Generation Iron awards. Okay, Generation <laughs> Iron. Nobody watches Generation yeah. Iron. Shit. That's what I'm saying. They're yeah. the only other bodybuilding awards out there. So yeah, this is more. Our show is more real bodybuilding than anything else. So yeah. our our awards should count. Well, I mean, they, they nominated Chris Bumstead for best arms on Generation Iron Awards. So. Did they really? Yeah. Two I years ago. They nominated me for best chest. What the fuck? Yeah. And me <laughs> for best back. I'm on best back. <laughs> they fucking nominated me for best waist? Like, what the yeah. fuck? <laughs> <laughs> they nominated me for rookie of the year. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking, I don't want to say, forget it. I'll leave that alone. I'll leave that alone. <laughs> yeah. So what's going on for Christmas? Anybody got anything good going on? No, really. I saw your video training with your dad yesterday, Nick. That was good. It was cool. Yeah, yeah. Or not the video, good. but the the Instagram post. Yeah, that was a good time. Is that the first he time sore, you train with your dad? He's sore as fuck right now. No, we we used to train together all the time. Like normally, when I have a show, like he takes off the f- the final week. Yeah. Um, he takes like his week's vacation, and he usually comes with me every day the final week. And we train together. That's cool. cool. That's cool. Uh, anybody watching have any um, questions before we go? God, this is Some, quick, you know. Someone please tell Nick Walker to unblock me. 
I went, <laughs> I went from hater to admire. That's Arab flex. You shouldn't have hated from the start. Best side tricep equals Brett Wilkin. I don't know. Ian's got a good side tricep. Yeah. I think best side tricep is Ian's. Brett's is pretty good. I'm not taking anything away from Brett, but that's like your shot. Kind but of. you are, and then you are. The guy, the guy said it. The guy said Brett, and then you went, "Nope, I'm going to take it away from him and give it to you." Literally took it away from him. Literally did that. Are we saying on the podcast or overall? No, overall, best side tricep. Broly. Girl, no, no, good. No, no. But it doesn't. I'm talking about the you whole. Actually yeah. side oh, I'm talking I don't know. We were talking about back. We fucking went from the waist up. No, no. But he said the guy said pose. That's why I was saying pose. Oh, okay. He's got a pretty nasty side try too. Yeah. yeah. Uh, best ambassador. Ian was one of the only ones still on a podcast close to a show. Brings honest conversation. Hard as fuck training. Yeah, yeah. Say Ian's, I say Ian's a good Ian's ambassador, good. but he shits on everybody. So and then cool the drama. Yeah, cool <laughs> yeah. drama and Cut picks around. Around, so no. <laughs> that's the, that's oh. the best part about me. Uh, new this guy wants to know New Year's resolutions. Does anybody do New Year's resolutions? You're all born. No. Seriously, nobody does a New Year's resolution at all. Oh. Why the fuck would you do it? Just do it before. Why do you need yeah, to wait for fucking New Year's? Fix shit beforehand, man. People wait, shit people wait to, wait fucking to, to start on a day that they're going to fail on anyway. So it's why, are you guys so, why, are you guys, why are you guys all so hardcore? What, <laughs> what's, your, what's your New Year's resolution? I well, I don't have one yet. I'll think about it. But I'm just saying. No like, more DoorDash. No more DoorDash. No more. Yeah, I deleted all those apps off my phone already. Did you? I deleted. It. See, see, you did it before New Year's. I love how you guys <laughs> think that that's a. But big that's not. Book. But that's not as my. As you re-download it, it saves all, all your fucking infos there anyway. But I'm not gonna re-download it, guy. That's the whole point. Oh, sure. Yes, you are. But, hey, I haven't yet. Look, you're, yes, haven't you yet. Are. Hey, you're proving guys' point. You didn't wait for New Year's to take. To no, but that shirt. wasn't my New Year's resolution. My New Year's resolution is something different. <sighs> what is it? It could be like, yet. like this year. It could be like to be nicer to people. To suck your own dick. I feel like that was the one. Suck my own dick. Suck my own. Back to this. Oh, old this year I will try dick. my hardest. <laughs> I well, you are losing effort. weight. You're losing weight, so you know, you're getting. I will closer. remove one rib to, get, to yeah. make it happen. No, um, no, it could be something different. Maybe some people like to take the holidays and just act like assholes and do whatever the fuck they want, and then like, okay, January first, starting point. Who I just explained what he's gonna do. Well, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking normal. You guys aren't normal. Most people like to relax on the holidays. Dude, and enjoy you just themselves. went off the rail last week. You said you were eating pizza, and burgers, and fucking wings. Last week, last week since he left Dallas. Okay, can we stop? Uh, top talking about my eating. Yeah, don't, 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 <laughs> I'm re- I'm retired now. I get to do whatever the fuck I want. I don't have to listen to you guys. I'm fucking retired. I don't have to worry about. He doesn't like shit. this intervention. I can I can eat whatever the fuck I want. That's the whole point of retirement. I don't have to worry no, about looking. That's not the whole point. Well, part of the point. No. Ian, uh, this guy also, and he paid for this, says Ian deserves ambassador, the ambassador award. He is pure at heart. What? And he has the best love story in bodybuilding with Melissa. <laughs> paid for this? What does that mean? It's super chat. The chat. People, yeah, people super chat. So they paid for their, their, well, like, their message. Be highlights. the one now. It highlights the message. Be paid for it. I yeah. think if Ian didn't cause shit with so many people, he would be a good, a great ambassador for bodybuilding. That doesn't make me a bad ambassador. All publicity of course it does. Is good publicity. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. Yeah, here's Roman. Why? Do you ever see Jay Cutler start shit? Well, maybe he should start no. more shit. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you guys are talking about Jay Cutler starting shit now when he's retired and social media wasn't around back then when those guys were battling. So you can't compare yeah. that. I don't yeah. think Jay Cutler would have been talking shit even Jay, if social media was around. fucking absolutely Jay talks shit. I guarantee it. Oh, come on. Whatever. I don't even talk shit. I just say honest things. It's not talking shit. You want, you want to phone a friend? Yeah, call Jay. Here we go. Putting him under the pressure now. So, so first the guy comes on swing. Remember? I mean, the, the axe with the fucking chopping wood. Now he's trying to call Jay like, I, on the I'm calling Jay Cutler. Remember guy, the Olympia? I want to be you. Remember the Olympia when they were interviewed backstage? And yeah, Ronnie said, would... I think you're smoking crack. That's different than just being on a podcast ranting about people that competed 20 years ago. What did I do? Should I remind everybody? <laughs> what? I said he was overrated. That's not fucking shit talking. <laughs> That's, like, That's shit talking. I'm just saying ambassadors don't do that thing. That's all I'm saying. Sorry, you guys are all too big of pussies to say it. Come on. Not well, well, I don't believe it, or else I would say it. That's the thing. It's kind uh, of a point. How's he got a point? 
I think so. No. Sometimes I sometimes I grit my teeth and I feel like I should say something. No, that's not true. Because an ambassador is the one that always tries to put a good face on it. Not not always no, tell no, the truth. But some yeah. motherfuckers need to be told. That's not. The I disagree of- because you're you're conflate you're you're misconstruing me putting down bodybuilding with me giving my honest opinion on something, which is too complete. I don't ever say bodybuilding yeah, fucking sucks. Fuck these guys. But, shitty. Yeah, I don't do that. I'll just like, this is my opinion. But it's but not that your opinion. Is- a good ambassador is only going to be promoting the good stuff. He's never going to be. That's right. Even going. It's to not that fuck, your fuck opinion. Being is that my opinion. Fuck being that guy because that's not real life. You don't have to yeah. be that guy. You don't have to be that guy. I'm just no, saying. No, that's, that's what I'm saying. It's not real life. But that's what that guy is. That's false. Like, it's yeah, false that's what the ambassador is. And it's not, it's that's not, that's not what false. The it's not, it is it's false not. living, man. That's not being true. That's being a Wait fucking a like, trickster. Wait a minute. It's not false. If, what if you can appreciate every physique without having no, to no, be like... No, no, but if some fucking... It taps you in the industry. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait. Yeah? And Come you don't go back at him. You're, you're, on the, you're on the assumption then that I don't appreciate... When I say something about Kevin or Kai that I don't appreciate their physique, that's incorrect. I do appreciate their physiques. I'm just making a statement saying how he is discussed in the conversation is greatest of all time or these things. I don't agree. And I think that it's an overrated okay, statement. I'm not, That's saying, not saying that. I'm not saying your appointment is wrong. What I'm saying, what I'm trying, your opinion is your opinion. It's as valid to you as anybody else's. What mm-hmm. I'm trying to say is an ambassador of the sport leaves that out of the conversation. Yeah, like, a, like an ambas- a good ambassador would know when not to say something. Yes. As well. That's my opinion of, of, of well, what a good that. ambassador I'm not doing that. No, and that's, that's, that's not everybody. Look, not everybody... But that doesn't mean it's it's a lie just because you don't have like maybe you just don't think that way, right? Like I don't think Jay Cutler's pretending to be a good ambassador. I think that's just the way he is. Yeah, but it's different, like he said, because he's out of the sport. Yeah, it's easy for him now. Yeah, mm. it's not the same. He's, he's, not under, the he's, under, Look, he's Flex, under fire. Flex Flex is the same thing. Flex promote. You won't hear Flex bashman. I'm gonna tell you this: there's a lot of guys that won't say a lot of things because they just don't want to fucking rattle the cage. I'm just gonna leave. Yeah, yeah. yeah, but, yeah but, 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 that's, but but that's that puts them into the role of amb- being a good ambassador for the sport as an overall in terms of pushing it into a positive light. That's not saying that Ian and James aren't being truthful or the, the other guys aren't being truthful. It's just a different role. Yeah. I disagree only because I don't think that me saying something like that is putting bodybuilding in a negative light at all. I think giving well, an opinion or something that whether someone disagrees with or not is not not promoting body. Okay, let me just let me put it this way. If it causes drama, then it's not good for the sport. I disagree because it's promoting it. It's still promotion. It's not promoting. Promo- no, 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 no. I don't know. Yeah, you- Neg- you Negative can, promotion you can be a is good not promoter. Promotion. Yeah, you, you can be a good promoter, but not a great ambassador at the same time. You can be yeah, fucking... I, which I, I agree with if you were shitting on people like Sean Ray style, but I don't do that. No, look at... I'm not... We're not saying you do that, but you just said something that's not accurate. You said any... Like any publicity is good publicity is pretty much what you said. No, not necessarily. I'm just saying the kind of things that I'm saying aren't negative publicity. Like they're not bad things that are demeaning bodybuilding. If... 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 Ron Harris and Kevin Lavroni have to do a podcast to explain why you said it, then it's drama. Well, it's not my fault that people don't listen. That's not my fault. And hey, that's, I mean, it's not, you know, like what did I say in that? That was negative or taking down. What he's saying is, he's saying it's not an ambassador of the sport will will not get involved in any confrontations. Yeah, Yeah, just leave it out. That's it. That's what he's saying. Whether I agree with that is is totally different. But that's what he's trying to say. Look, I have opinions. I have opinions about certain bodybuilders. I'm just like, it's not necessary for me to say it. I'll just leave it out. That's yeah. for you guys. So you guys want to talk about it. That's all good, right? But like, I think if you're trying to be a good ambassador sport or trying to promote a sport or trying to put a good face on it, then you just kind of leave those conversations aside. You think I Sean agree, Ian's, but in, Ian's, in Ian's defense, I think he didn't expect this to blow up like that. Of course not. No, but that's because he's just saying why, his opinion. But that's why the great ambassadors yeah. are aware, are aware of the things that they could could go that way, you know. They're mitigating that. So being a good ambassador, you just be a chicken shit. That's it. That's not. <laughs> no. See, that's a... Why do you think that just because you, you bite say... your tongue? You just said sometimes I don't say. I don't it. bite my but... tongue. I don't want to. I don't need to. I don't care. It's not but biting if it comes my tongue. up in the conversation. If I really want to say, say it, something, I will say it without fear of it. Listen, I don't fear. If I really want to say something, I'll say it. Right. But if I feel like it's not necessary and it's not helping anything, then I'm just going to fucking dump it. 
So when we're right. having a conversation about overrated bodybuilders, which was literally the conversation, the conversation on your podcast that you started <laughs> with yeah. your questions yeah. was yeah. most overrated bodybuilder. I give my opinion. It happens yeah. to be the most popular bodybuilder. And then I'm the one that's the bad ambassador, even though you all answered it with questions too. Do you know, sometimes you have uh, wait, a question. I'm not, wait, 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 this is, this is a good You point. guys so, all answer the questions too. I just happened to say Kevin. On the I'm, line, not, I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to say I'm a good ambassador for the sport though. What I'm trying well, to I'm say, I'm not saying either. I didn't nominate myself, they did. I'm just saying that's a, a silly, it should make it, yeah, and it shouldn't be a bad one. Like yeah. I say, yeah. So, you think a good ambassador just tells the truth, whether it's good, bad, ugly, I think, it doesn't matter. I think a good ambassador <laughs> is just someone that promotes the sport. It's not relevant to if you say good or bad things. It's if more people come to the sport of bodybuilding and have been joined into bodybuilding, I think all of us could fall into this category. Hey, I think ready, you, don't this. Need- you think you think I'm a good ambassador for the sport? Yes, absolutely. Yeah, I I open my mouth more than anybody. This is do true. I, do I think do I think you're a good ambassador? Yes. Do I think you're the best ambassador? No. Well, I'm no, but that's what I'm not saying. I'm the best ambassador. I'm not. But the that's one that what the guy. The but that's what the guy said in the thing. So I'm just saying that, right? I know, but all I'm arguing is the do definition I think, wait a minute. of ambassador. No, no, no. There's but we're talking about the best ambassador, right? Like <laughs> yes. if we're, if we're talking about all of us being ambassadors, of course we are. We're all in the podcast. We're all trying to drink, bring people to bodybuilding. We're all it's trying to make people, it's, we're a all trying to, it's a dial. It's a dial. No, because right. you guys are literally saying that if you're someone that says exactly. these things are not an ambassador. I no, no, I meant, no, 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 no. The I'm best talking about the best ambassador. So the then I agree. Ambassador. So then I agree. Okay. Then sure. I agree. So like sure. anybody who, anybody who's posting regularly on Instagram or interacting with fans or like any of that shit, that's a good ambassador, right? Mm-hmm. But I think when you talk about the best ambassador, that person's always bringing positivity. Always. That's how. I, that's what I think an ambassador. I, that's my opinion of what an ambassador is. It doesn't mean like he's a chicken shit or a pussy. When I think of Brandon Curry, I think of that's a great ambassador. I never hear him say anything negative. He's got a, always with his family, always with his okay, wife. Okay, so wait, let me ask you this. Who would you say in the UFC, who would you say is the best ambassador for the UFC? Um, Probably... Old school, I would say Randy Couture. New school, I would say George St. Pierre. And you don't think Randy Couture ever like said shit like that? He did all the time. Randy Couture, Couture really. wasn't known as a shit talking fighter, and neither is no, he wasn't neither a shit talking fighter. But, but neither is like, George St. Pierre. Take George St. Pierre then. Oh, hold on, I think I think I think the person that brought a lot to the fucking UFC, Conor McGregor, too, and he was wait an a second. Yes. Wait a second. Wait, could be could be best to be one. Of the- Khabib has to be one of the best ambassadors, and the guy wouldn't get involved yeah. in shit talking. And he's an asshole. But I think. George St. Pierre even more because he did more media stuff and he actually put a really good face on the sport for like people watching, you know, Nick, what's his name? Uh, Nick Diaz tried to get shit with him and tried to start shit talking to him. He just left it all aside. He's like, I don't give a fuck. I'm just going to beat your ass. And he kept mm-hmm. it all positive. It's like Nick, like it, we talk about Nick Walker. People <laughs> are fucking picking at Nick Walker all fucking day long. Does Nick say anything back? Never. He doesn't say anything. He doesn't do anything. He just goes about his business and fucking does it on stage. That's a yes. good ambassador. He doesn't ever even fucking entertain the shit. To me, that's a good ambassador. Like so I have to, sometimes I get a little bit. No, listen, everybody's different. I get on that YouTube, man. I get on that YouTube, and I'm not going to come to your ass. You can't burn your ass down. I mean, some people want to let it out, and they should, right? But everybody's oh, yeah. different. I think some people are naturally geared to staying in the more positive lane, and some people want to fucking lash out. Some people want to say their opinion. Everyone's different. Well, look I mean, at. Do you think the best? The best ambassador of bodybuilding is probably Chris Bumstead, right, Ian? Yeah, I would agree. And he doesn't he doesn't bring anything negative to the table. He doesn't address all the, you know, the the comments, the drama. That's that's true, but I I'm all I'm not if he did, I don't think it would make him less of a bo- uh, ambassador. I think he's just the biggest ambassador because he has the biggest following. No way. No way. I think I think so was Chris, the way he conducts no. the way he conducts no. I, I, I think Ian can comment the most on Chris because he knows him the most. It doesn't matter yeah. if he knows him the most. It's he does he does because he knows his personality and he knows how he's conducted. How himself. does that matter? It doesn't matter. If it, listen, he has those. He has I'm not disagreeing. I said I agree. Chris was, but I don't think he's a better ambassador because he doesn't yeah, stay out. Because he stays out of drama. No, no, no. Chris is a be- Chris has a personality that matches his physique, and that's why he has the following he has. He doesn't have a following and just happen to have a good personality. He has that following because his personality is fucking like. He's the golden boy. Mm-hmm. Like that's that's why he has that following. If he was yeah, a fucking it, does, actor, it also does only come down to what do you show. 
Yes. No. Yeah, but that's, that's what he's saying. That's no. But that does matter too. But that's, because that's because what it's it's you can have you can have all the talking about right now. You can have all the conversations you like in private, but they're private. That's right. How you conduct yourself openly to the public is what's being perceived as being an ambassador. That's right. I so, see. I disagree that Chris would be a worse ambassador if he started a little more drama. I don't think it would make him any less of an ambassador. I think it would totally tarnish his fucking image. Yeah, I the guy disagree. is like the guy is like. But maybe you're too involved because you're in the inner circle. I think maybe more from, people would jump on the Terrence train then. You from, know, from, I mean? the, like, from the outside, from, from the outside looking in, Chris is like the pure golden boy. And if he started getting into involved in drama, I bet you would turn people off. Hmm. It's just my just like how for do you every think- person for every person you turn off, you turn someone else on. Yeah, but what kind of so it depends on what, what kind of what, what kind of person are you? Demographic. But what yeah, kind of still, person still, are you? If they still love bodybuilding because of it, what does it matter? No, no, it does matter because what kind of following do you have? If I have a hundred thousand followers that just love drama and shit talk, or I have a hundred thousand followers that are pure of heart and just want to watch me train and talk about bodybuilding, I'd rather have this following. It's not equal. 100 k following is not equal. Like whether they're assholes or whether they're nice people, but they, don't, they don't have to. They don't have to be assholes if they quite enjoy the drama. Well, if you're just in it for fucking, let me hear all the shit talk and bullshit. That's not a following I want. That's what. That's what. The, that's the fucking times we live in. I'm afraid. I don't think so at all. Jay Cutler. <laughs> Jay Cutler. <laughs> Jay Cutler is still very popular. You don't talk Most, shit. You don't do anything. We live, in, a, we live in an age of the internet where it's all about gossip. Wait a minute. No, uh, yeah, well, wait but, a minute. Listen, no, wait a minute. How, no, 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 no. Hang on. How you conduct yourself can influence someone else. So if you conduct yourself like getting involved in drama because you think that's what the people want, you're just encouraging that. You're part no, of No, but that's not the case. I'm not saying you do it because of other people. If you're naturally someone that wants to react and respond, don't no, that's fine, but I'm saying it. if you choose, like, if you're, you're looking at it, if you're looking at it going, well, that's getting the most response. So therefore, that's, yeah, how that's I'm not, now that's not what I'm to saying. Be. I'm saying if someone mugs you off, you're more than entitled to mug them off back. It comes down to is it's hard to dictate who's yeah. going to follow you. I don't think no, you're avoiding the drama. You, you, you shouldn't even fucking care about who follows you or not. It's all, wait a, Kai Green told me this. You don't actually have fans. No, like, James, you wait don't a actually. It's all fucking temporary. Like everyone gets too fucking caught up on this shit. Like fuck. But that's why. But that's why someone. But that's why. Like, someone wow. Does it matter? Me. Who but cares? James, you're paid exactly. You your life. Who gives a fuck? Exactly. But I agree, and that's what. That's why someone gives me shit. You resonate with some people. You work with others. Don't have but to James, play a Wait a minute. Part. But James, I agree. And that's why if someone gives me shit online, <laughs> I look at it, I look at it, I put it down, and I go back to my family. I don't yeah, get cool. all fucking that's cool. Blah, blah, blah. that's cool, but okay. some people ain't like that. Some people are like, do you know what? I'm gonna tell that person. You, yeah, but you just went, oh, but you just went, oh, it doesn't fucking matter. So if it doesn't matter, no, what doesn't matter, matter is if you are that way, you can be that way because you're allowed to be. It doesn't matter. James, I'm you saying you could be any person you want to be. James, five minutes ago, you said we live in an age where it's all about gossip and all that shit. Absolutely. Okay. I, we have, I, we have the most popular podcast in bodybuilding. We don't shit talk anybody. We don't no, do the, go- no. we don't do the gossip. We don't do the drama. I'm not saying each that. Other. If each someone, other, if someone, do. Wants, I'm if the someone one gives gossip, if someone gives shit, because I yeah. do that. Yeah. Wait, I don't what? know. Check up that WhatsApp, what, WhatsApp chat. Say that again, Ian. I just said, you said that we don't do the drama and the shit talk and all this stuff. And I'm literally the one that's saying, I can't be He's the master biggest... because apparently I do all that. Yeah, but wait a minute. <laughs> you you say some things that stir the pot, but we don't do like clickbait drama shit. Okay. Yeah, but that's... Actually, name one thing that I've said that was actually <laughs> bad. No, no, I didn't say anything bad. I'm saying it stirs the pot a little bit. It just gets people talking. You're not yeah. saying anything gossipy or like horrible. You're just saying your opinion about a bodybuilder that most people don't say out loud. So it stirs the pot a little bit. It's not that okay, it's like, so then that, but then that does, then that then diminishes me as an ambassador because I'm giving my opinion. You well, just like then said that I'm not shit talking. I'm not, I, the pot. I I'm not causing drama. I don't think ambassadors stir the pot. That's just my but opinion. I'm, not, I'm not intentionally trying to stir the pot. I'm just giving a, an answer to a matter, question that I'm asked. But it doesn't matter if it's intentional or not. Okay. Answer me this. If Chris was on a podcast and you asked him who the most overrated classic guy would be, would he, well, maybe classics because it hasn't been around a lot. Bodybuilding. Would he pick an icon and be like, that guy's overrated? If that was his opinion, then yes, you would. He would give it? He would say that? If it was his opinion, why the fuck would you lie? Well, That's okay. so stupid. Okay. It's not well, about yeah. lying. Leaving it out is not lying. But if that's an example, my, wait, 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 let me you put, my it. opinion is exactly <laughs> that. I think that Kevin is the most overrated and I say someone else, you're then lying. What if you just say, I don't want to answer that? Then you're a fucking pussy and you're a fucking loser. <laughs> we hey, just, so that really means, like that, wait a minute. Talk about that means, sucking dicks a lot that better means, wait a minute. That means you're a fucking pussy and you're a loser because we just did a podcast where we asked who the worst Mr. Olympia was and we all agreed to skip it. 
True. Well, I'll answer it. Is that, that's not the point. No, that's not no, the, no, no. That's not the point so, of you answering it. The point is, that it doesn't okay, hey, hey I, I've got an example. Arnold Schwarzenegger was like the kingpin of being a master until very recently, and then he started to lose some. Yeah, but he also used to talk tons of shit back in his heyday. Can I say something? <clears throat> I never wanted to go back to talking about dick so bad. <laughs> yeah, maybe we should just leave it. I enjoy it. this. You, so know, you know, can't handle it. Just, I feel like you don't can't just handle it. Edit, just edit that bit out. We're I live, can't. asshole. <laughs> uh, really? That, that, I mean, you're just all you're essentially saying is that you need to tiptoe around the fucking two yeah, 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 No, no you're is you're that, looking at it in a different way. You're looking no, at I'm it. No, I'm not. What are you saying there? What are you saying? I'm saying just look you at the you positive side of it. Your, you have to edit your opinions to be a good ambassador. You have to leave your opinion out if it's going to stir the pot. Yes. I, see, I, I feel I'm, I'm a V on this. No, no. That's, that's okay. stupid. That's literally wait, 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 the wait, wait, stupidest wait. thing I've ever heard. No, listen. listen, listen that, why listen. is it the stupidest? Stop, we just have, we have, not. we already have an ambassador that does that. Relax. We already oh, have boy. Jay Cutler is literally that guy. Does anybody heard him say Ian, Ian, hold on. Listen, <laughs> Ian, I'm very similar to you. So I agree with you 100%. But as far as being the best, I agree with what Fuad says. I, I'm on the same page as you because I'm an asshole, just like you. So I agree with everything <laughs> you're saying that somebody is that truthful shouldn't be looked at as not a best ambassador. But unfortunately, because of social media, the best ambassador doesn't rust, rustle anybody's feathers. It's not ever. just because of social media. It's very simple. In my opinion, okay, this is just my what opinion. What else is it about? Because there's no this, magazine. So no, no, this is just my opinion, okay? I don't care if you guys think it's wrong, that's fine. My opinion is, at every choice, right? Every choice, everything that comes up, you have a choice. If it doesn't put a positive face on the sport, that doesn't make you a good ambassador. It makes okay, you wait, a good ambassador. Wait, wait. So let me answer this. So when Hold on, I let, let him finish. Hold on, let him finish. Let him finish. Change it to the best let ambassador. Finish. Doesn't make you let the best finish. ambassador. Hold on, let Fuad finish, because we're not going to get anywhere, and I'm going to fucking end up I, I, did, I, I, I did finish. I did finish. When you have those choices, a, a, the best ambassador will choose to make always the positive light and not stir the pot. That's what I just I said. I do agree with that. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. You said okay, no. Wait, wait, wait. So let me ask you this. No, I didn't. If you ask, get Jay oh, I, I just said it wasn't. I just said it wasn't because of social media only. I said, no, I, I said, I go, I go, the best ambassador never wants to rustle feathers, period. Yeah. I yeah, agree. Okay, fine. Said. But it's not just about ruffling feathers. It's about, I want to make bodybuilding look good. That's just my yeah, but, and, and doing that, you you don't rustle feathers or or get involved yes. in confrontations. Yeah, but it's not, but it's not Russell. It's Russell. But I agree with Ian. For me, I don't look at that cool, as uh, best, yeah. I don't look at that as being the best trait. But I agree that it is. But hmm, I'm that's fine. Ian. That's you know fine. what I'm saying. Look, so that's Ian. You everybody can every good. Everybody can do it their way. I'm just Nick. Nick what's your opinion, Big Man? I'm out of it. He's doing the right thing, see? I'm not <laughs> getting involved right. in this one. <laughs> All right, I think it's, everybody... It's, everybody's this is why it. Nick's going to go all the way. Can we do a virtual <laughs> hug? Part of the week. All, everybody in the chat. <laughs> I'm, not touch, I'm not touching you. Everybody, everybody in the chat is angry. Just left. Yeah, they're all like, fuck you guys. <laughs> what are the comments? Is empty. This is why we don't do it live, because if I could... If we would not have done this live, I could have cut that half an hour out. What are they saying in the comments of that? They're like, skip this Shut conversation. The Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I don't know if they are. I don't know if they are. But this is what happens during the podcast that they don't see. Yeah. The for all you guys, for all you guys watching, this is how some things normally devolve into these kind of conversations. And then I have to chop half an hour out of the thing. Men are going at each other, and that's why we that's why we go from like fresh to exhausted in like. Yeah. So now time. we're all like, all right. <laughs> all right, we're gonna do one more. Yeah. Let's do one more question. Good one. Yeah. I trained with Jordan Peterson. Yeah. That was good. Uh, can, I, uh, can I just add one more thing? Jesus no. Christ. Just, just one more thing. No. I think, you I gotta just, be the fucking last one, don't you? No, it's not because like I want to have the last fucking word. bite. Like the last bite, no, you no. gotta. Yeah. I'm like that girl you dated that yeah. had to have the yeah. last bite. The last yeah. bite. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You gotta just, no, I just want to yeah. say, why, real quick, I think Ian's taking offense to what I'm saying, and I'm not trying to be no, offensive. No, no, no. Look. I didn't ever, oh, when you guys fuck. said the best ambassador, I never put my name out there. I could care less if people see me as ambassador or not. I literally don't give two shits. All I'm saying is that I don't think that if you state your opinions and you, I think by avoiding opinions, that doesn't make you a better ambassador. I think that makes you a fucking pussy. Okay. That's fine. Yeah. That's okay. So we both shared our opinion. Then. Because That's like it. the things we're talking about, listen to the things we're talking about when, in my, when you're giving me as an example, me saying we, a question that we all answered 
I just gave an opinion, an honest opinion. I didn't think it would ruffle feathers, whatever. Another thing about the Urs thing or the, the Ramon thing, it was just asked, blah, blah, blah. I answered it. I wasn't trying to ruffle feathers. I know. It was Ian. an honest answer. So you're I saying that's it. like my me just giving an opinion said I should be, I don't want to answer. That doesn't make you a good ambassador. It makes you a fucking cheap piece of shit, you know? So you're saying I'm a cheap piece of shit then? You answer the questions. No, I don't. You always answer. I don't. I've literally done the podcast with you for two years. You answer almost every question. Yeah, but I don't. What's going on? It's here? like a whole new guy, argument. Guy and <laughs> oh, yeah, let's just leave this argument behind. Let's just leave it behind. Jesus. Guy and Ben. Guy and Ben would sleep. Guy, I, I got to tell you, everybody in the chat wants you to do 100 push-ups. <laughs> my fucking balls. No, guy. I'm serious. Every, is Ben in bed? <laughs> everybody in this chat is asking you to. I'm. I'm not even joking. Like literally. Every single person is messaging mm -hmm. guy do 100 push ups. What is this? A <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just telling you what they want. You can say no to them all. Yeah, man. It's like, the, it's, it's like the dinosaur thing all over again. It's just like 100 push ups. Just like fucking. Just do it, guy, real quick. Just that. take your jacket off. And, and he knows yeah, he take your axe well. and jacket off. Me and <laughs> Ian didn't, don't think he can I'm do it. I'm going to say that I don't want to do this right now. Well, okay. Okay. okay, well, everybody we'll in see. the chat. You're a bad yeah. ambassador for the sport. We'll see. <laughs> I'll try to yeah. do it right now, but I'm not in the mood to do it because I'm exhausted. Listen, you assholes fucking talk. You're going to try and do it? I'll fucking give it a shot right now. All right. Every, all right. Here we go. Look, I'm going to switch to I want to switch to to just the guy view. No, really? no, no. Then I don't want to do it. Then I don't want to do it. Uh, okay, cam. fine. I'll leave it on gallery. Fine. Fine. Guy cam. What do you think, Brett? Is he going to do it? Oh, he's no. Gonna... Nick thinks Nick Listen, says no. I don't want to do it, so I'm banging out hundred and I'm done. I'm not fucking yeah. Hey, but we yeah. want to see your reps though. So like turn the camera down. Yeah. He's turn not your getting out this screen burner go. Wait. Yeah. So Roman, do you think he's gonna do it? Uh what? I think it's what's a going on? I think it's a I got a million fucking things on, bro. I'm sweating my ass off. <laughs> Roman, hey, is he gonna do this. it? He's not Roman, is he gonna do it? He's going to do uh, 60%. Brett, is he going to do it? He's doing it. James? Yeah. I think he can, but, but his form is going to be too tight. No, no, what? his form has to be good. We're counting reps. Yeah, but good and, good and like... It's different. Like not no, not, no, no, not no, no, slow, no, no. but they have like, to be full reps. You can do these. Yeah, exactly. Like military reps. Like military reps. Like military 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 reps. No, reps. guy. I think, I think he's going to do it. I believe in you. I right, so okay. here, I think I think he can do it because he weighs like 150 pounds, but he might get injured. <laughs> he's gonna tear a pack. <laughs> but, All right, no, keep going. Love, I love you, guy. Weight. It's not enough weight. I can't believe this is what people care about. This is so stupid. Let's go. Get go started. On, go. Wait, so there's no bet, right? No, no, just do it. We just want to see if you can do it. It's free. Right, go. Yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. Points. Wait, 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 wait. wait. So who's, 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 counting? who's counting? Who's counting? Someone okay. said. I'll, I'll, I'll count. Who had, who had someone has said. Up. Someone has said that guy has T Rex arms, so this should be easy. <laughs> <laughs> Paul. Okay, somebody asked go. where Paul is. Paul's on vacation right now. Uh, who's going to okay. say now? I believe in guy. Who has conductor? Okay, go ahead. Silence. Count? I'll count. If you start fucking bullshitting counts, I'm done. I'll count, I swear. They better be good reps, though. They better be good reps. They better be good reps. You count every time my fucking elbows come up. I don't want to hear a goddamn thing. <laughs> I, I never seen, I've never seen my granddad do 100 reps before. Let's okay, go. Okay, come on. Let's go. Come on. Go, dude. All right. Three, two, one, go. One, three, two, three. Those are half reps. Four, five, five six, 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 seven, seven eight, 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 nine, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. You want to have a conversation? Why do this? Make it easier. 24, 25, Oh, we're going to keep watching. 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55. 57, 58, oh, 59, 60. 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, Come on, 8, guy. 9, 70. One. Bring on. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 80. Two, Bring on. Three, yes. Four, five, six, four. Seven, eight, nine, 90. 90. One, two, on. three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
100. Hey. 100. Yeah, hey. Whoa. I don't even fucking breathe heavy. Those that are half breathing heavy. Stop. Those I'm are not even out of breath. Smoke Get the this. fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even breathing heavy. Half reps. Those are half reps. That was reps, good. Man. That was good. That was, that was good. Okay. Yeah. That good. Yeah, that was good. Reps. Those weren't they full. Count. Those weren't full. No, like shut that. up. They no, count. No, they count. No, no, they those were good. I can't They're win good. a bet when I win a bet. They good. They're good. good. That's they were good. That's they were good. easy for you, guy. Huh? That was pretty easy for you. Don't question me ever again. I'm going to make you dye your beard. I'm going to make you dye your beard in 2022. That's my New Year's resolution. Look at that, look at that pump. Yeah, but the oh. reps weren't bad. I'm, I'm talking to the chat. The reps weren't bad. You did all right there. I agree. Um, what is the best rivalry rivalry the pa- this past year in, in bodybuilding, and what's the best rivalry going into 2022? Well, the Nick and, Blessing, think- Nick and Blessing one was good. That was fun. No, it wasn't. It was <laughs> good. It was like, good before. It, wait, it was good until we got to stay. It was good yeah. until it got to the stage, and then it was oh. like, oh. Yeah. I like the Nick and Ian, like, friendly <laughs> rivalry, because they're like... Yeah, yeah, but rivalries me, are supposed to be like... Me and Kuklo. You and Kuklo was a good that one. Was yeah, good. That was yeah, for the good. Arnold, yeah. That was yeah, a good one. Good. Was there any others? Those were probably the two biggest ones, right? There was a, yeah. a, little bit of, a little bit of rivalry at the Olympia with Hunter and Ian. Well, and also that was Shaban last year. and Regan. Yeah, that, was Shaban actually, and Regan. that was just at the O, though, and that really wasn't a rivalry. That was more well, last year, I think. What about um, yeah. Shaban and Regan at the O? I don't know, the O, the, the Kuwait, uh, the Egypt one. I th- uh, Shaban, I don't think he was happy to get beat. Oh, yeah, him. that was beef, eh? I think so. He thought yeah, Shaban won. Yeah, but he beat that's, him that's, at the Olympia, didn't he? No, but that, that was between him and the judges more than anything else. Though, right? I don't know. That's what I'm wondering. I don't know much about it. So I thought that might be quite a good he, he, I think he slammed the judge in on it rather than, you know. I think the Ian Kuklo one might be better only because it was a tighter race. And, and the, way that, the, the way that they got involved with some of them. Yeah, there was some heat. There was some heat there. Yeah. I remember seeing some of the posts. I was like. The Nick and Blessing one was bigger. But because the competition didn't pan out, I think the Ian Kuklo one is bigger. Because that's going to be a big one. That's going to be. I I agree. I agree. And I think that one going into 2022 might be big too. Ian, what do you what do you think? Is there still like a? Ian start taking down for. You think if you compete with with Steve again, there'll be a rivalry? Bring it on, boy. Yes. Uh, Yeah, I guess. I don't know. Sure. I think, but I don't want to bad mouth anyone. I'm being a pussy. Um, no, I think Ian's on a upward trajectory, and I think Steve is less so. I think he might be. Yeah, well, I can declining. agree with that too. Yeah. So I think Ian's going to pull away from him now. I think oh. where they met, I think where they met last year was on a crossover. You know, I think Ian got him. Like he was good, but I think Ian's trajectory is going to be better than where he was. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that's a that's a good one for um, 2022. Samson and Nathan. Because Nathan beat him three times, and then Samson beat him in Prague. I'm picking Samson on that one. Yeah, yeah it's a good rivalry there. Someone's wrote Samson and Raphael. They're both UK guys, right? Samson and Nathan as well. So they're both fine. Yeah. Like, yeah. You know, I don't think British. Samson and Raphael is a rivalry. Those guys like. Oh, like that's not a rivalry. Yeah, those guys like. They're I like haven't. I've never heard each other, so. them even mentioned together. So. Okay. <laughs> When's Roman's comeback? Because he discussed that. I don't know. I might have missed it. Yeah, I'm playing doing the, the indie pro in May. Oh, you're in indie again? Yeah. Yes. Been there. Dave's cool. Yeah, Dave Bowers is a good guy. Yeah, I want to get the free t shirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he runs a good show because Luke did that twice. I think you're one. Yeah, I've done it too. It's a good show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. D, D. Oh, you did right. uh, 2018, Ian, right? Yeah, so did Roman. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Is that when um, Steve won that one, right? Steve yeah. won, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I was I was sixth, and you were fourth, Ian, right? Yeah. Oh, hey, that's when Melissa made me deaf in my left ear from screaming. She was sat her she was sat right behind me with uh, Chris and Milos, I think, and she screamed when you walked on, fucking banshee on my left ear. <laughs> my, my, my ear, I had straight bleeding out my ear. I was like, oh my god, that doesn't surprise me. <laughs> I, uh, what's oh, the biggest... that was the, remember when the taxi driver asked you if you're, uh, he, he, he asked you where you're from. You said from, from London. And then he said, when you're going back to Australia, 
Yeah, he, everyone always thinks he's a Australian fucker. I just remember you with that miniature camera. Like, if you're ever with yeah. Roman, he's recording. Oh, yeah, he had that camera, he's yeah. fucking recording everything with this spy yeah. camera. It's like this, this little thing. cube, like. Yeah. yeah. Nick, what are you doing? You sleeping? No, bro. <laughs> no, bro. <laughs> what's the you. biggest it, what's the, what's the biggest argument we've had on this podcast the one that just oh, that wanted to blow my brains out cheat meal thing. No, no 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 wait the me one Ian. where or you me and uh, ben. Yeah. no 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 it's about to get dark Ian, out Ian, i gotta fucking Ian, finish you remember up. you remember we when we here? were talking about um we we're talking about politics and the store opening and not having he cut it out guy was it was me it, guy yeah. ian yeah, oh, yeah, I heard. oh, is this about the, the um, oh, seg- we not segregating about... the clothes and the toys? No, worry. Wasn't it about no. free speech? Yeah, free yeah. speech. Yeah. yeah. Oh, the free speech one. Fuck. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. That was a while. That was a while. Yeah. That, was that was early gruesome. on. But I came back like a week later and I told Ian he was right. Yeah, but that conversation was brutal. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That never got aired. That's dead. That's gone somewhere. I have it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> lost tapes. The lost tapes. You just do a podcast and post all the arguments. Just all the color stuff we cut out. Oh my god! Imagine. Post. Yeah. <laughs> we don't cut out that much shit. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Think so? <laughs> a few occasions. I think people get upset when we cut out stuff, but I don't think I, we cut out anything really important except for like a few big arguments. I had like a hundred people DM me asking what the names you bleeped out were. I thought that was just funny. People got annoyed. They're like, why is it so annoying? You're beeping. And I'm like, I thought it was funny. Yeah, I thought it was so many people. Did you watch it, guy? I no, watched I it. Yeah, I beeped out the whole thing. But anyway. <laughs> All right. Are we done? Everybody sure. want to go? Go eat. Love you guys. Yeah. Yeah. I love you, Ian. Happy Christmas. <laughs> right, love you guys. Christmas. Merry Christmas. Ian are, you, Ian, are you mad at me? I'm not bad at you. James, are you mad at me? No, I, I quite enjoy getting a bit of heat out. So I like a little that. bit of heat too, right? It's you fun. do need it, man. It's boring in life if you don't have bit. I wish mean. everybody would get involved. Everybody just tuned just out. Just a little just... bit, you know. Just it's I fine. got involved. What the fuck? Yeah, man. Um, guy just went silent. But fucking Nick went to sleep. Because they're trying to, who has, I get who yelled at for interrupting. Oh, here we go. Don't even say it. Yeah, fuck you. It's because they're not, trying to be I'm good not... ambassadors. <laughs> if friends can't have a little go, you know, at one another, they're not really friends. I agree. I know you're going to say that. All right. I love it. You knew I was going to say that, eh? I totally <laughs> knew it was coming. I'm like, here we go. Fuck. They're trying never to be good gonna, ambassadors. Yeah. Never going to live that down. It's um, cool. But do you know what? I will laugh. Can I just say one thing before we go? I reckon that's going to get clipped and put on another podcast. 100%. Why? What are they going to cut, though? <laughs> the beef in the... I think in Ian the and Fuad are, the, are yeah. coming to an end of the podcast. <laughs> yeah. They're about to break up. Beef Fuad and Ian are going to fight. Podcast. Yeah. Ian, Ian starting Ian Star- Star- his own podcast. podcast. Ian freaks out. Without I naming any names. <laughs> without naming any names, do we all think it's hilarious that there's another podcast that basically is a copy of our po- of all the shit from our podcast? Yes. Yeah. It's basically, I, I, do, I do find it funny how a lot of what you do becomes the topic of another podcast because then it's like they're just reporting you. It's <laughs> satire. They're like just reporting you. Because we have so much to. content, it's like the only thing for them to talk about. Yeah, but it's such a and now we're do- and now we're doing it back, and it's like Inception. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying I noticed. We're not doing it back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we maybe haven't mentioned we're, names. We're, we're in that important. We need to be talked about more often. Maybe then? Yeah. All right. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, are we? Uh, I should bring this up since Guy wanted me to talk about it live. Uh, how many names of the podcast are we going to have? Oh, fuck off. <laughs> Three. Guy, since you brought it up to me. Oh, I I, guy's very attached to being on the bros. Well, first of all, we had a bro chat that we we, we, we had somebody I didn't even fucking. I go, I, I go, I don't even know this guy. You're calling it bro chat. Who the fuck? Like, because what am I going to? I can't call every podcast something different. Yeah, but you, you, bro, chat took on a meeting with certain people, and when those people aren't on, I gotta fucking hear about it. Yeah, but Ian, like but, Ian, but, annoying but, shit. but Ian was on, so then what? What? Ian was well, on that bro chat. What, was, what the original was? What you, Ben, me, Nick? No, the original was me, me and Ben. Ben. It was me and Ben. I know, was... but there was two, and then there was three, and then four, and then it was no, after me and Ben. It was after me and Ben. It was me, Ben, and was... Paul. Yeah, and, and then, then and then you came on after that, and then it was that was that for a while, and then well, I don't. All I'm saying to you is right now, most of the bro chats are me, Nick, you, and Ian. So if I have a podcast with Ian. I think, hang on. I think I even named it bro chat. You did actually. 
No, because well, you're a story. Brett, I, I heard the story with Fuad uh, that it was Fuad and Luke, the bro chat, and then I heard it was Fuad. No, 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 no. Luke, Luke, Luke and Fuad were bodybuilding and bollocks. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And then Fuad and I one time did once uh, Luke passed away. We were just, and me I and came. you were talking on the phone, Ben. Me and you were no, talking on the phone. And you're like, let's okay, do a, and you're like, let's do a podcast. I'm like, no, he's like, yeah. And Ben was like, we'll just have a bro chat. Yeah, yeah that's why I remember you saying. So I that's just called I it yeah. bro chat. Yeah. And then that's where we started. We were starting about, we were just talking well, what about. What I'm like, saying is we had, we had a consistent and then it started like, there was like, it went from four to like fucking 12. Because people get busy and other people want to be on the podcast. So I got to put them on. So I'm like, I don't know what to call everything. Well, you, you, breast you, you, breast, you breast the on body then body you had the other one. Then you, you had your yeah, one. But on it's one. silly because now I have a bunch of podcasts that are all the same with all. Well, you things. you changed the name and then you start. Then you made it confusing. Okay, since you're all here, let's have a general consensus. There's bodybuilding bollocks, and then bro chat. Do we need a third? Is that what we're I thought you have best of the rest. So I have to have three different name podcasts for the all third, the, same cool, the third, third cool out. You can third have third call out. I think you could just have yeah. fucking one name. I don't think it matters. What I said to Guy was, what if I have third call out, but Nick's on it? And then is Nick third call out? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> That's only for the guys. Nick probably will I'll, do I'll never be the third that. call out. <laughs> <laughs> you have, See? the thing is, you have, I think two. I think bro chat and bodybuilding bollocks. You have to keep bodybuilding bollocks because it's you and Okay, let me ask you a question. What, what's, what's the differentiing factor between the two then? If you That's what I, 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 all I know is I'm, I've never been on bro chat. And I don't think I should ever be. Bro That's chat. the main factor is it's, it's Ben and, and James on Bodybuilding Bollocks because they are an extension of Luke. British. Yes. And well. that was Luke's podcast. And then bro but, chat but Brett, everything but else. Brett speak, like Brett and Ian, Ian was on Bodybuilding Bollocks. Yeah, I've been on Bodybuilding no, 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 Bollocks. I'm, I'm, I'm not saying nobody yeah, else is like a I'm saying James and Ben are usually like one of us has to one of us has to be on, and then for bro chat, I think for bro chat, either Guy, Ian, or Nick has to be on, and then it's a bro chat, right? Does that work, guy? Basically, yeah. Guy doesn't seem happy. No, I was just (laughs) it was very confusing. It's all very confusing, but there's a whole bunch of like there's look, there's eight of us here now, and there's like three other people that you know, there's still like Paul, and there's now Logan wants to be on and Justin Shire, and it's like if we're going to get, if people are all going to be on, then it's just like, it's hard to fucking figure it out, right? Eh, messy. It just gets messy. <laughs> Glad it's you, not me, mate. All right. <laughs> um, okay, boys. Oh, I'm tired. Merry I'm going to eat some fucking food. We should, record these, from, we should record these from now on. Oh, this isn't recorded? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's recorded. Oh, then saying, we should not do it live. We should not do it live. <laughs> <laughs> All right, anyway, guys. Merry Christmas to everybody. Right. Love you guys.